Today, I'm going to create and play a bunch of fake Strongest Battlegrounds games, such as a game that I made to catch online daters, a game that I made with a bunch of memes, and even more. So watch until the end and comment down below what your favorite fake game is. Number one, the game has to have guns and nukes. I don't know why Sides of a Battlegrounds doesn't have guns or nukes in the game. They should definitely have added them by now. Challenge two, we got to add a new character to the game that isn't currently in this one. You guys can probably already guess what character I'm going to be adding. And the third challenge is that we need to get 100 people to play the game. If I can't complete these challenges, I have to give away all of my Robux. So yeah, let's do this. Now, before I make the game, I want to take some inspiration from some other fake games. There are some very goofy ripoff games. So we're just going to search up the strongest battlegrounds and see what pops up. The first game we have is the strongest battlegrounds V2. Let's see if this is a W game or not. I just loaded in and there's quite a few people in this server they also have this welcome screen so let's see what exactly is on here if we go into settings we can turn on and off shadows on and off music and we can make it nighttime okay that's kind of cool the characters they have are saitama garu genos and metal bat you guys already know i'm gonna pick the metal bat now let's load into this game for some reason the game is really blurry like i can't even see my avatar i feel like i'm blind from what i've heard the weakest dummy is able to fight back apparently Yo, he's running at me. What the hell? Yo, why does it look like the weakest dummy is kissing my avatar? That is sus. Okay, why is he chasing me? He's literally faster than me. How do I get this man to go away? I really like the dashing in this game and this guy is still chasing me. I'm gonna test out one more character, which is Genos. Oh, we can do incinerate? Huh? Bro, this move is so goofy. Okay, I think that's enough fake sites of Battlegrounds games. Let's go ahead and create our own now. Now, before I actually create the fake game i need to make an alt account because if there's any virus models in this game i'm not trying to get my actual account banned i've had this account for like six years and i have a lot of robux on here let's put my birthday as april 20th 1969 aka my real birthday the username is gonna be mango pool is the top g and the password you know what i'll have the password hidden somewhere in this video and now it's time to create a new base plate now my friend was somehow able to get the entire site from a battlegrounds map i don't know how he got this developers please don't ban me i won't leak this map to anyone i only use this for youtube thumbnails but if you want me to delete it off my computer i will delete it okay now the first challenge that i gave myself is to add guns to the game i used to do a little bit of scripting back a few years ago but i'm on a pretty big time crunch right now so i'm just gonna add a free model gun and hope it doesn't have a virus let's just search up gun and see what pops up and there's a gun spawner right here <laughs> I want to give people a few different options though. So we got like an AK or something. I don't own any guns in real life. I don't know what the names of them are. So if I say any of the names of the guns incorrectly, feel free to correct me in the comments. I think this is enough guns to troll with. These should be pretty fun to use, but I also said I was going to add nukes to the game. I just searched up nukes and I found this model right here called Mega Nuke. So we're going to put this in the game. Hopefully nobody activates it. I'll probably do a huge explosion later when we have more people in the server we should be pretty good on weapons but before we go to the next challenge i want to make sure the guns work so we just loaded into the game let's grab one of our guns <laughs> bro look at my avatar it looks so goofy holding this but let's see oh okay it works how about the weakest dummy can we shoot him okay the weakest dummy is just built different he's like me um he can't be shot let's see does our other gun work this is an ar-15 <laughs> yoink oh that just one shot him <laughs> and it looks like the pistol also works i know the nuke definitely works but i don't want to launch this until we're in a public server with a bunch of people in it now that we got guns out of the way though we can actually move on to our second challenge so our second challenge is gonna be a little bit more difficult because i think i'm gonna have to actually like code the character into the game so before we add tatsumaki i kind of want to add some memes into the game the first thing i want to do is add a giant model of skibbity toilet on the map i do not know why skibbity toilet is so popular but but every single YouTuber makes these videos that are like, I called Skippity Toilet at 3 a.m. and almost died. Gone wrong. Don't try. And it's like so funny. So we're just going to put a giant model of Skippity Toilet on the map. Let's upscale him. <laughs> Let me know in the comments what you guys would do if you see
see this under your bed at 3 a.m. And the other meme I want to add to the game is our boy Grimace. I couldn't find an actual model of Grimace, but I found this Grimace shake right here. So I'm going to upscale this as well and force everyone to drink the Grimace shake. Nobody is going to be joining this game and making it out alive. And of course, we can't have the Grimace shake without McDonald's, bro. So if anybody gets hungry, they can just walk to this McDonald's right here. I would be here anyways if I wasn't making Roblox videos. And I don't want to make McDonald's lonely, so we're going to put our boy Stud working in McDonald's. It's not his exact avatar, but it's a zombie, so it works, okay, guys? The other thing I want to add, too, is an adoption center so that if your kids are misbehaving, you can send them here. This is a pretty W adoption center, I would say. This is where all of the toxic players from my videos originated from. They're all adopted. I also really like how in the game earlier, the weakest dummy could attack you, but I don't feel like coding a script for that. So I'm gonna add in one of these zombies right here. These used to be in like every Roblox game seven years ago. Basically, this zombie runs around and kills you over and over again, and you can't do anything about it except cry and punch your monitor. Another thing I would like to add is a cupcake shop. You guys will see why in a second. Let's just search up cupcake shop. Let's see what pops up. This looks pretty good right here. I would say it's like a W cupcake shop. And the reason we have a cupcake shop is because EDP445 himself actually came here to get a cupcake, guys. Before I add Tatsubaki, I just need to test this game and make sure there's no virus scripts at all because I have added in quite a few free models. Bro, why is the zombie attacking the weakest dummy? Yo, I gotta save the weakest dummy. Nah, what are you doing, Mr. Zombie? That's right, Bozo. You're dead. You don't mess with the weakest dummy. Only I can kill the weakest dummy. We got McDonald's right here and we got Stud working in the McDonald's. Oh, wait. I'm holding a gun. I can probably get arrested. You know what? I'll rob the McDonald's. I don't care. Open up the cash register. Yes, yeah, so far there are not any viruses in the game, so it's it's looking pretty good. We also added Tatsumaki to the server finally. Look how beautiful Tatsumaki is. Let me go ahead and actually take a screenshot of this so I can add it to my Tatsumaki folder. Let me just drag this screenshot over to get what? I was not to show I was not supposed to show this in the video. Yo, the editor, please cut that out. Anyways, now we have to do the actual hard part, which is getting 100 people to play this game. And I think I have a couple different ideas on how I can do this. The first way is through Roblox advertisements, but I need to actually upload this game to Roblox before I can make an advertisement. So let's just go over to file and publish to Roblox. Instead of titling it the strongest battlegrounds, we're going to title it the stupidest battlegrounds. And let's just press create. Now that our beautiful game is on Roblox, let's go ahead and make it public and now we can create our roblox ad now my freshman year in high school i took a class that talked a little bit about marketing so i kind of know how to market stuff and one form of marketing that they talked about was fear mongering which is what we're gonna be doing in this roblox ad we're gonna scare people into playing my game so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a picture of skibbity toilet right here we're gonna copy and paste this image and put it into our advertisement and then we're gonna put some text that says join or he will be in your bed tonight I, I changed up the text a little bit to make it pop out more, but I don't think this is eye-catching enough. I think some people might scroll past this, so I'm gonna use my YouTube thumbnail making skills and turn the saturation on Skippity Toilet up a ton. The more saturated something is, the more eye-catching it is. So, I think this looks pretty good. If you guys saw this advertisement, would you click on it? Let me know in the comments. Now, we can go on Roblox and go to the advertisement tab. I really hope Roblox doesn't decline my beautiful ad. I'm gonna name the ad join my game now so that if someone hovers over my ad this is the text that'll pop up join my game now and let's upload this and wait for roblox to approve it in the meantime another thing i can do is use my roblox account to promote the game i have 41,000 followers on this account and i have a roblox group with 53,000 members so i can definitely use this to my advantage what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna turn my joins on so that anyone who looks up my profile will be able to immediately join me in a game and then and I'm gonna announce on my Roblox group. If you want to be in a video, go to my profile and join me. Joins are on. And then we're gonna put this as a group shout. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna go on my Twitter account as a last resort and also tweet out for people to join me, but I don't really like using Twitter a whole lot. Like, all that people do on Twitter is just hate on people. There is no positivity on this website. But yeah, let's just load into this game and wait for it to fill up. I'm really hoping we can get 100 players in this game. Bro, this map 
is so goofy. Let's launch the nuke. Oh no, it's playing the nuke sound and it's launching into the air. Oh, someone just loaded into the game and the nuke just exploded the entire map. Okay, no, what just happened? That explosion was insane. I had to reset the whole server. So you know what, guys? I'm gonna change that. I am going to release the best 17 plus game. Just wait like two days. Now, before I actually create the game, I want to take some inspiration from some other 17 plus games because there are some games on here that are pretty interesting. I can't find the actual category though. So I'm just gonna search 17 plus and we'll see what games we find. 17 plus don't join the most scary game on roblox okay it, it, it can't be that scary um what is this house why do i have a sword oh uh, i'm, I'm kind of scared there better not be any jump scares let's let's go outside oh, oh what is that what is that why is it chasing go away go away go away why is there even more of that there's a whole army of them chasing i'm leaving this game bro i am leaving a fat dislike on that game bro but I definitely want to add some NPCs that chase you around in the game. So I'm, I'm probably going to add something along those lines. Roblox adding 17 plus games is actually kind of a good thing in my opinion. There's this game I used to play like five years ago, which demonstrates what goes on in Russian prisons. And I used to play it all the time until it got taken down, which it was a pretty violent game, but it's back up now that Roblox has 17 plus games. I want to load into this game really quick and also take some inspiration, but I'm just stuck on this loading screen. Does it take Roblox? Roblox this long to like verify my age or something. Okay, boys, we're in. Um, this game isn't the exact same as it was five years ago when I played it, but how it works is this is pretty much like a Russian or like North Korean prison, and you do a bunch of experiments on the NPCs. So I just grabbed the virus from this thing right here, and then I'm gonna go inject it into my uh prisoner right here, and we just have to sit, wait, and watch what's gonna happen to him. Oh, bro, just exploded. Okay, I think we've taken it enough inspiration from 17 plus roblox games now it's time to make my own actual game i'm gonna go ahead and make an alt account though because i really don't want to get my main account banned i'm trying to come up with like a controversial day that i could put as my birthday but then also i don't want to get canceled on twitter so i'm just gonna put like a random day let me just check real quick did anything happen on june 28th 1997 okay nothing happened on that day okay good i'm gonna call this account mango pool is so cool and oh um, the password i will make sure that the password is hidden somewhere in this video because in my last video where i did this my editor forgot to put the password uh, but we'll do it this time if you guys find the password for this account please don't do anything bad i don't want roblox to revoke my privileges of using their website but yeah let's go ahead and create a blank base plate game now luckily one of my friends who's a developer was somehow able to get the seismo battlegrounds map i have no idea how he got the map and if the developers want me to delete it off my computer I will delete it. I only use this map to make my YouTube thumbnails and I haven't sent it to anyone. But yeah, we got the map right here. Since this is a 17 plus game, we can pretty much add whatever we want to it without getting the game deleted. You know what? I have an idea. I'm gonna add a bunch of YouTubers doing horrific, unspeakable things in my game, but I need to download this plugin thing right here. And now I can use this game to slander a bunch of different YouTubers. So I think the first person we're gonna slander and smear their reputation is stud you know what i'm gonna have stud murdering a bunch of people inside of a mcdonald's so right here this is our mcdonald's thing and then let's go over some plugins load character and let's type stud's username <laughs> we got stud right here i just searched up blood and we're just gonna add a bunch of blood throughout the mcdonald's not gonna lie this doesn't even look like blood this just looks like someone was like on their period and they started bleeding everywhere but it'll work stud is gonna be holding a sign that says this blood is here because of me if any police come here i did this haha <laughs> guys um stud is gonna get arrested el bozo <laughs> laughing emoji but bro did stud really think we were just gonna stop at a little bit of blood no we're gonna add a bunch of more stuff we're gonna go to the back of the mcdonald's right here where they usually hide all of the dead people um and then i just searched up dead person in roblox models we got this guy right here let's just add like a huge pile
pile of them in the back of the McDonald's. This is usually what goes on in McDonald's in America. Oh, this isn't a dead person. This is a nearly dead person. Okay, even better. The back of the McDonald's looks pretty good. And then in the bathroom right here, you know, we can't just leave this empty. I'm gonna add hundreds of illegal weapons into the bathroom. If you own an illegal weapon, how long can you go to jail for? One to 15 years in jail or prison? Okay, as long as I have like 100 illegal weapons, we should get stud a minimum of 100 years in prison and a maximum of, of 1,500 years. Let's go! Keep in mind, guys, stud isn't gonna be able to beat me to 100k subs if he's in prison. You know what? I'm gonna take a screenshot of this and send it to stud on Discord. Got anything to say, buddy? I'll let you guys know if stud replies to this message. I'm gonna slander some more YouTubers in a second and get more of them put in prison, but I just need to test this real quick to make sure there's no virus models or anything. Okay, so far it seems pretty normal. Uh, I'm not lagging or anything. I don't think there's any viruses. Oh, Sud just replied and said, what the hell? <laughs> you're going to jail. Good luck trying to beat me to 100k when you're in prison. Yes, sir. I would say this is like the typical McDonald's in America. Wait, what's this sign say? This blood is here because of me. If any police come here, I did this. Okay, Sud, I'll make sure to let the police know that you did it. I wonder what's in this bathroom right here. Oh, hundreds of illegal weapons. Let's go. I love illegal weapons. Oh, and there's also a bunch of dead people back here. Yo, son, you're getting arrested for a long time, bro. I think the next YouTuber I'm gonna slander in my 17 plus Roblox game is Floaty Zone. So we just spawned Floaty Zone's avatar right here. Now, I think what we're gonna do with Floaty is we're gonna put him in like the back of an alleyway right here. And then behind him, we're gonna have like a bunch of white vans. And then as you can see, Floaty Zone just typed in the chat, I am offering free candy to anyone who gets in my van. Yo, why is Floaty Zone? kidnapping kids and putting them in vans floaty zone that's really bad i just googled how long can you go to jail for strapping kids in vans and it looks like this is punishable by up to 20 years so if floaty zone kidnaps at least five children that means he's gonna be in jail for 100 years just like sud I can't believe that, like, Floaty Zone is kidnapping kids and putting them in his vans, guys. That's so messed up. So, I'm just gonna find a bunch of different models of, like, random kids. And we're gonna put them inside of Floaty Zone's van. And, wow, guys, look, there's a chat bubble coming from someone inside the van saying he said he would give me free candy, but he didn't. Please help. Wow, guys, th th this is really messed up. Why is Floaty Zone kidnapping people? I also am gonna add a giant statue of Grimace. Here is our boy Grimace right here. He looks, uh, really trippy <laughs> i just got a notification on twitter wicked said you terrify me i'm just gonna reply with this screenshot <laughs> and this one <laughs> this is my game so far do you like it <laughs> now since this is a 17 plus roblox game i'm sure roblox doesn't mind me adding a giant statue of tatsumaki so let's just take this statue right here and we'll upscale it a ton <laughs> let's just keep upscaling it yo i kind of like this view right here wait no no i should not have said that yo editor um cut that of the video i think this statue looks pretty good let me just screenshot it so i can save it to like my folder yo guys hey 100k subs should i reveal everything else that's in this folder right here i'm gonna go make a few more changes to this game and then upload it to roblox and then i'm gonna invite some of you guys to play it with me I just set my joints to where everyone can join me in game and I'm gonna go to my Roblox group with over 50,000 members and just write on the group shout guys if you want to be in a video join me <laughs> let's just wait for everyone to load into my beautiful game <laughs> bro this Tatsumaki statue is so tall okay someone just loaded in hi do you like the game and he said yes let me show you around bro everyone's starting to load in <laughs> This is where Sud committed many crimes and he will be arrested soon. He just said K. OMG! <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna use the Fifth Amendment and get one of these illegal guns. No, he can't see the guns! I need to shoot him before he sees any evidence! Okay, uh, that, that guy's gone. Oh no, another person came in here! Oh man, what the? <laughs> guys, don't go inside the McDonald's. No, this guy's going in the McDonald's. He just looked in there and is like, what the frick? I just said, everyone follow me. <laughs> Floaty Zone is getting free candy, guys. No, oh, everyone's going in the van! Oh no, someone's stealing the van and driving away! Yo, I need to shoot them before they can drive off! Oh no, all of the vans just got stolen! This guy just said to help in the chat because he got kidnapped. Do you guys like the Tatsumaki statue? And this guy said, no, you don't like the Tatsumaki statue? Well, you're gonna die! Yeah, you don't disrespect Tatsumaki ever again! Anyone who disrespects Tatsumaki will be killed! 
and this guy just ran me over with a van. But first, to make sure online daters are actually gonna be playing this game, I'm gonna take some inspiration from some games that online daters actually like to play. The first game we're gonna take some inspiration from is Club Iris. I always saw online daters in this game. It used to be really popular back a couple years ago. Oh my gosh, copyrighted music! No, we're muting that. I am not getting my video copyright claim. If you wanted to find a Roblox girlfriend like two years ago, all you had to do was join this game. Why do I have to agree to terms of service to play this? Well, we're gonna try and find out why online daters like to play this game because, um, yeah, look at these people's avatars. These are like the most online dater avatars I have ever seen. Yo, I'm gonna sit next to them. I found someone chilling next to his, uh, his Roblox girlfriend. We got a bunch of people dancing right here. Okay, this is one thing I've noticed a lot of these games have. They all have a ton of emotes. Bro, even the strongest battlegrounds has a ton of emotes. That's probably part of why online daters are playing it. We've also got like a hangout area right here, so we're definitely gonna have to add one of those to our game. Yo, you can buy private hotel rooms in this game. Okay, we're definitely gonna have to add that to our game. Bro, what are these people doing right here? What is Ice Spice and whatever, whoever this guy's name, what are they doing? She just said she's 17. There's no way anyone in this game is 17. Like, bro, what is going on here? There is literally two people making out right in front of me, bro. This is literally like Roblox. What is this game? Some of these emotes are like, what are, what is this emo? What's this person doing? There's just like a group of emo people right here in the corner. These people are like exchanging their ages in the chat. No, this game is really weird, but I think I know a game that's even weirder. <laughs> there used to be a game like three years ago called the Hug Hangout that I saw it all over Twitter. I don't know if this game is still around. Oh, it got renamed to Friend Hangout. <laughs> oh no, what is this game? Ice Cream Vibe Hugs. Okay, if they added ice cream to this game, people are 100% like not actually using it for ice cream. They're definitely using it for, uh, for something else. You can buy admin commands in here. Oh my gosh, that would be so fun to troll with. Okay, I want to load into this game and see what else is in here because I want to take some inspiration from games that online daters like actually play all the time. Hopefully we don't run into anything too sus. Um, let's see. Why is there a whole bedroom right here? They got couches and stuff too. And there's a whole balcony for you to jump off of when your Roblox girlfriend leaves you. There's just like a bunch of people arguing in the chat over here. Girls shouldn't be able to vote. They should. Okay, nah. That guy is going to get my video freaking like taken down. Oh no, I just saw two people walk into here. Bro, what are they doing in here? Bob127429. This is not the sub. This is not the route you need to go down to, bro. You can do better things than this. He's begging her not to unfriend him right now. Not gonna lie, I think we've taken enough inspiration. Some of these games are pretty weird, but I know 100% this game might be at a risk of getting taken down, even though there's nothing wrong with it. I'm just making this to catch weird people. So I'm going to make this game on an alt account. Put the birthday as February 5th, 1981. I don't know if anything happened on that day. The username is gonna be Mango and then a bunch of numbers and the password, guys, I'm gonna have this hidden later somewhere in the video. And let's sign up. Now what we need to do is we need to just make like a base plate really quick. Wait, hold up. Why did Roblox change the default avatar to this? Bro, I want the default avatar to be a bacon hair, not whatever the freak this is. Bro, rest in peace, bacon hairs. Okay, let me actually like create the base plate now though. One of my friends sent me the strongest battlegrounds map to use for like thumbnails and stuff, but I think I could probably transform this map into like a freaking like online dater game or whatever to catch them. I think the first thing we're gonna add to bait the online daters is a giant statue of Tatsumaki. I just searched up Tatsumaki in like the toolbox model thing and I found this. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna upscale it like a ton and make it like super huge. Right now, I think this looks pretty good. I'm just gonna have to take a screenshot of this really quickly for like personal reasons. Just gonna have to drag this and this into my Tatsubaki folder. Wait, no, I'm recording right now. Yo, editor, cut that out of the video. Go delete that. Cut that out of the video. I'm also gonna add in like a bedroom because I know earlier like a lot of the online daters were going in like the bedrooms and stuff. Let's see. I just searched up bedroom. Honestly, I think this should be pretty good. Oh no, it has two scripts. Okay, hopefully none of those are virus scripts. Let me just like test this game really quick. I need to make sure that I don't get any virus scripts in this game because I don't want it to get deleted. Bro, what is my avatar? I don't understand why Roblox changed the default avatars to this. Like, look at it like blinking. Wait, is this 
what it, is this the roblox avatars that like automatically sync with your camera wait let me test this out with my camera i'm like talking right now i'm moving my head around okay good roblox can't see my camera um does this bed work not gonna lie the bed doesn't work but it's fine it'll it'll get the job done another thing that i noticed all of the games had were like emote uh gui things i do not feel like scripting out like an entire emote gui so i'm gonna see if i can just find a model that has like a script for it i'm gonna just search up emotes and is anything pop up oh emo bar roblox emote gui okay let me add this i'm pretty sure now i just need to drag this over to like starter gui i don't know i have not oh yeah it works okay here's all of the emotes right here dude we have so many of them <laughs> i want to load in actually and test out some of these emotes really quick okay so we got the monkey emote uh what is the sleep emote hey yo he got this emote bro why does some of these look so goofy especially with like the avatar what's the Disney emote yo i can like do a backflip <laughs> We're gonna add an ice cream shop to the game. Yes, sir. You guys do not understand how much this ice cream shop just lagged the game whenever I loaded it in. But yeah, we got a bunch of ice cream in here. I'm gonna add in a few more things in a bit. But what I also wanna add is some admin commands for me to troll the online daters with. I'm just gonna add in HD admin because I know this has been around for a bit. I think it got hacked like once, but I'm not making this game on my main account. So I should be fine. And then also I'm gonna add like a secret room up here here up here this is like my building that i'm gonna fly up to and then spy on all of the online daters with and also i want to be nice so if any of the online daters get hungry i'm gonna i'll put a mcdonald's right here just in case any of them get hungry and i think the game is pretty good for now except i have one problem i need to actually get the online daters like inside of my game i need to get them to join me so with the power of roblox advertising i'm gonna create an advertisement first though i need to like publish this game to roblox so um i'm gonna title this like club battlegrounds because like a lot of the online dater games are just called like clubs or whatever and then i think we can just create this and make the icon later yeah okay we should be good we got the game up on roblox right here so now it's time to make our advertisement i got the ad template like right here and i think the first thing i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna search up like roblox slender avatar okay yeah and then i can copy a few of these we'll add in the avatar like right here <laughs> okay um uh, uh, this looks pretty good i think this looks good so far one tip if you guys are ever making like an advertisement or something that people are going to click on if you want it to catch their eyes you want to make it as bright as possible which is why we're turning the saturation all the way up to 200 red is also the most eye-catching color i'm pretty sure so we're gonna make the background red and then we're gonna put text that says do you need friends because if i put like do you need a girlfriend roblox is gonna 100 decline that and get rid of my ad and like like delete all my robux so i think this ad looks pretty good let me just save it and upload it to roblox i'm on the page where we have to upload the advertisement i have to name my ad i'll just put do you need friends now we're gonna upload this to roblox and hope that they approve it right now it says pending approval and then what i'm gonna do right now to get a few players is i'm gonna join my roblox group on this account oh my do i seriously have to do this captcha okay i finished the verification we're in the group and then i'm gonna go back on my main account and we're gonna give this account admin i'm gonna turn my joins on where everyone is able to join me and then i'm gonna type on my group shout if you like tatsumaki join me on roblox <laughs> i need to remember to leave the group once i'm finished recording this video but i'm gonna join the game and see if anybody joins me this video is getting pretty long so if you guys want me to make a part two where i like actually go into here and catch the online daters make sure to like and subscribe all right boys so today i had a really funny idea yeah. I'm gonna go hire a blocks roots coach and then act like a complete noob and then at the end We're gonna 1v1 and I'll show him my true power So I'm on this website called fiverr You can pretty much pay people to do anything on here But we're just gonna search blocks roots and try to find a coach I'm not gonna lie. There are some weird people on here like this guy is selling any blocks fruit for five dollars Pretty sure that could get you banned from the game. I'll grind your blocks roots account to max level Come on, bro. I'm trying to find an actual coach okay wait this guy kind of looks trustworthy i will teach you how to become pro at blogs fruits and we can pay him five dollars for a one hour trading session you have to message people before you order though so 
I'm just gonna act like a little bit of a noob. Hi, I'm a new player and I really want to get good at Blocks Fruits. Do you know if you can teach me how to play? I want to have a huge Dark Blade and be really high level just like Rectway. And sends message. Now, let's just wait for this guy to reply, boys. Alright, boys, so it is the next day and the guy from Fiverr actually added me on Discord. He just messaged me. Yo, 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 Mango Pool. So I just said, yeah, what's up? And he said, are you ready for the training? Okay, boys, um, I need to, like, disguise myself as a noob one second. It's like, I can't just be wearing all these expensive items like my vault. I think this avatar that I have should be pretty good. So let's just reset. And now let's message him. Yeah, bro, I'm ready. And he said, okay, join my server. This dude has the worst grabber. But, okay, yeah, let's join him. Oh, wait, a fruit just spawned in the server that we joined. Okay, let me get this before I talk to Hobby Hero, the gamer. And we got ourselves an ice fruit. Okay, not bad. Let me just store this. And now let's talk to Hobby Hero, the gamer. All right, we just pulled up to Pirate Starter, and here is Hobby Hero. For some reason, his avatar is an Evo Goose, and he just said a hi. Yo, what's up, Hobby Arrow? Have you ever played Blood Fruits before? <laughs> no. Okay, I'm gonna teach you how to play. You will be so pro. You might even be able to win a 1v1 against me. Okay, I mean, we'll see about that. I just asked what's the first thing that I should do. We're gonna see what Mr. Hobby Arrow says. The first thing you need to do is kill the bandits. Get the quest. Okay, so far, so good. Let me just get this quest. I will get them low for you. Okay, W coach, boys. He's getting all the bandits low for me. So, yoink, yoink, and yoink. I only need to kill two more, so there. And we finished the quest, boys. I finished quest. What level are you? Oh, uh, what should I say? Level 20. Level 20 already? Yo, is he suspicious? Oh, no. I told you I can make you pro. Oh, okay, okay, he's not. Now follow me and roll a fruit. Oh, he probably thinks we're like a high enough level to roll now. Okay, I have a really good idea for how I control him right here. Just watch, guys. We are at the Blood Fruit Dealer. How do I roll a fruit? Walk up to this guy, click on him, and it lets you roll. Oh, okay, this guy is very smart. Let's see what fruit we get, boys. Okay, diamond fruit. No, I have a better idea. Let me go into my inventory. I'm gonna unsure dragon fruit. Yo, look at what I rolled. He said, OMG, that's a bad fruit. Yo, what? Is this guy trying to steal my fruits? Just go ahead and give it to me. Okay, no, you wanna play this game, bro? We'll play that game. Since it's a bad fruit, I'm just gonna do this. Follow me. I think you guys see where this is going. Hey, what are you doing? He's spamming stop in the chat. And let's just pretend to drop the fruit. Bro, why did you do that? I was gonna keep it for you. You told me it was bad, so I dropped it. I tell you to give it to me. It wasn't a bad fruit. I was just trying to take it from you and scam. Yo, what? Did this blood fruit coach just admit that he tried to scam me? <laughs> Bro, what? Wait, typo, I spell wrong. I meant that I was trying to help you. Oh yeah, he was just trying to help me by like stealing my fruits, guys. I don't know what scam means. Anyways, you have Robux. I have 5k that I bought earlier. Perfect, come with me. You can buy a fruit instead. Okay, I kind of want to see what fruit this guy's gonna tell me that I should buy. Watch him be like, Kilo, it's the best fruit. You should buy it. He's already made me lose like 9,000 brain cells, so I wouldn't be surprised, you know. But we just pulled up to Midtown, and the blood fruit dealer is right here. What fruit should I buy? Just buy any fruit. And get me one too, please. Bro, this dude is gold digging. What? Gifting fruits gives you double XP. Oh, it does? Okay, I'll give you a fruit, bro. Uh, watch this, guys. We are gonna give him the best fruit in the game. Enjoy your Kilo fruit, my guy. OMG, I love Kilo. Okay, this is the stupidest blood fruits coach ever. I'm supposed to be the one pretending to be dumb. Alright, now let's just confront him. Where is my double XP? I forgot. The double XP thing ended yesterday. Bro, what? Okay, now buy yourself a fruit now. I already have a lot of fruits. I'm just gonna use... Eh, we'll use the new love fruit, okay? I think we control him with some of these moves, guys. I just bought a fruit. What you buy? Love fruit. That just released. I hear it's good. Bro, love fruit has been in the game forever. They just gave it a rework. Okay, let's go to the next island. Bro, this guy has such horrible grammar. I want to see how OP I make you. Okay, um, uh, let's just kidnap him with the flamingo. Yoink! And we just picked him up. Okay, I have a really good idea. I kind of want to drop him in, like, the middle of the air. Yoink! I just made this guy drown. Yeah, I don't see him anywhere. I think he actually just drowned. Why you drop me? Yo, I think it's a glitch. Glitch no affect me. I'm the top G. Bro, I'm pretty sure glitches can affect anyone. Bro thinks he's, like, ascended beyond the human race. Hobby Arrow the Gamer is the best Bloxfruits player. No one is better than him. Just come back to me! 
little town and pick me up! I'm not playing games! Oh no, guys, we've caused Hobbyero the gamer to become enraged. Okay, I think we're doing a bit too much trolling. Let's just do what Hobbyero the gamer says. He is gonna make me a pro Bloodsroots player after all. He said, hey, I know like what you did. I am a very serious man. Bro types so unprofessionally. What does he mean, serious man? And I don't tolerate buffoonery. Hobbyero the gamer, I'm so sorry cries thank you for apologizing now let's see how op you are follow me okay we're following him somewhere guys i think he's taking me to like the next island yeah it looks like pirate village okay um what are we doing here i want you to kill pirate we're gonna see how good you are um okay i guess yoink yo i am not doing any damage uh yoink omg i make you so pro now let's test in a public server okay like bounty hunting sure i guess i'm down let's just do an a normal public server <laughs> the people in here barely have any bounty i'm just gonna be bullying them let me re-equip buddha now all we have to do is find an actual person <laughs> we got hobby arrow on the boat usually there's people at jungle so we're gonna see if anyone's over here bro no one is here i'm just trying to bounty hunt <laughs> oh i see someone right there okay yeah they're gonna regret ever pulling up yoink oh my gosh they don't even have pvp on yo enable your pvp he said no okay well this guy is just scared of me people are scared of you that's a good sign you pro many people are scared of me oh are they oh uh, yeah let me just pull out my dark blade wait he's running away and saying don't kill me okay i think we're gonna hunt him down oh no no he's actually running away from me and he got on some random person's boat okay that's all good i'll transform no i need some this guy's speedboat bro is actually so scared of me he's having in the chat you are supposed to kill random people not me all right boys i don't know if you're thinking what i'm thinking Hobby arrow, I think it's time we 1v1. Okay, yeah. I'll beat you. Meet me at Coliseum. Yo, everyone comment right now who you think is gonna win in this 1v1. Me or Hobby Arrow the gamer. I am pulling up to Coliseum right now. Like, I am ready to absolutely destroy this bozo in a 1v1. And he hasn't even showed up yet. Hobby arrow, are you scared? Oh, there he is. Okay, I am ready to destroy you. Yo, nice joke, my guy. Yeah, you're gonna be the one getting destroyed. Three, two, one one go let me just transform his attacks are not doing any damage to me but uh yoink okay he actually just froze me yoink <laughs> he's raging in the chat and bro he actually just left the game wait what oh no he's typing who let him cook bro he just typed like every single swear word imaginable i need to blur this out wait i want to read the reviews on his fiverr page because if he's raging this hard bro i want to see if anyone else has like a similar experience wait i went back in my search history and found his page and it literally just put me on this error thing did i make this blocks roots coach delete his fiverr account oh my gosh I was trying to record a normal video when I joined my private server and saw my girlfriend hanging out with her ex. She quickly told him to leave the server and he was gone before I could even confront him. But whenever I asked Anna what she was doing with her ex-boyfriend, she acted completely clueless. So I went on an alt account and hid a secret camera in the server. And you guys won't believe what I saw. Watch the full video because it got even crazier whenever I confronted her with all the evidence. Alright guys, I found this really cool glitch in the strongest battlegrounds. I'm just gonna join my private server and show it to you. You guys i just loaded into my server hold up why does it say you've joined anna and uh yo why is there a guy named josh bro her ex-boyfriend is named josh hold up who is that over there and hold up why is anna spamming slash clear in the chat she clearly isn't even typing it right josh please leave mango is here no nah, i'm gonna go talk to josh what does josh think he's doing with my girlfriend no and he left bro what the hell did i just witness anna's gonna have some explaining to do she said hi mango smiley face and she just acting like she didn't have her ex-boyfriend in the server two seconds ago now i'm gonna ask her in the chat why was josh in the server she said i just joined what do you mean i literally have it on recording you've been in the server longer than me i have no idea what you were talking about i just joined okay why is she saying this i just saw josh your ex-boyfriend in the server with you why are you acting like you don't know what's going on you were literally spamming slash clear in the chat and she literally just said no question mark who even is josh bro he's your ex-boyfriend what do you mean he's asking me if i'm okay yeah i literally just saw it in 4k i have it on recording too are 
are you okay? Why are you acting like you don't know who your ex-boyfriend is, bro? This is so weird. She's just acting like I didn't see any of it at all. She said, did you take your meds this morning? Because it feels like you didn't. Bro, nah, this gaslighting right now is insane, bro. I just typed in the chat, Alda, stop trying to gaslight me and tell the truth or I'm leaving the server and she's just doing the keyboard emote. Yeah, that's her in real life with all of this capping. And she said, I'm the one gaslighting. Stop acting like you saw me in here with my ex. You know I would never talk to him. Why would I ever want to get back with Josh after all the horrible things he did to me? Bro, you were just acting like you didn't know who Josh was three seconds ago. Like, genuinely, is she okay right now? And she said, no, what are you talking about? Are you just having a bad day or something? Please stop trying to gaslight me. You know I would never cheat on you, let alone with my ex-boyfriend. Bro, she's being so weird right now. You know what, guys? I think I know what I might have to do. I'm going to install a hidden camera in this server. And if you guys are wondering how I'm gonna do that, you see the weakest dummy right there who's sitting on the ground crying? I'm going to replace him and take his spot and then use the free cam thing in private servers and I'll basically just have a hidden camera in the server and then I'm going to screen record everything that Anna is doing with Josh because she wants to play dumb. How's she gonna play dumb when I have it all on camera? Bro, Anna's just typed in the chat again. Wow, so now after you just tried to gaslight and manipulate me, you're gonna go silent in the chat? Bro, what? Yeah, she's literally having a whole yap sesh in the chat. I like how she's trying to make me look like the crazy one, bro. Like, that is insane. You know what, bro? Before I actually went and put the hidden camera in here, I, I just need to get my anger out really quickly. Boy, yeah, let me just put her in a stone coffin. Boy, bonk, bam, pow. And she said, Mango, what's wrong with you? Why are you attacking me? I thought you were my boyfriend. Okay, well, clearly you think your ex is still your boyfriend. I honestly don't even know what's up with her. After I finish this 1v1, I'm just gonna rejoin as the weakest of you. Like, I don't even know, bro. This is just so weird. Let me just wall combo her onto a trash can. Boink. Okay, I messed that up. But yeah, I'm genuinely just so confused, bro. Why was there another guy in her private server? And why is she just blatantly trying to hide it? Why doesn't she just do this in her own private server, bro? Is she dumb? And okay, she just picked up a trash can and threw it at me. Yeah, Anna just walked up to me and said, okay, you still haven't typed anything in the chat. And yo, what is she doing? Oh, bro, I think that's my sign to leave. Oh, but yeah, we're basically just gonna create a weakest summy account and then we're gonna sneak into the server. Actually, hold up. I wonder if now that I'm out of the server, if Josh is gonna rejoin, that'd be really funny. Let's check. Yeah, bro, Anna is in there. Josh is in there. And hold up, bro. Am I having a dream or something? Chat, is this real? My girlfriend is literally in my private server with her ex-boyfriend and Turkish Quandil Dingle. Guys, I need to finish setting up this weakest dummy account so that we can join and spy on them and see what's going on. I'm just gonna call the account Mango Weakest Dummy. I wish I had my old weakest dummy account, but it got banned, unfortunately. I think I was trolling with it in a public server and some kid just started raging and reported me 10 times. But yeah, I think the first thing I have to do is buy some Robux on this account. You guys already know, I gotta use my boy Lanky Box's star code. Editor, don't leak my credit card again. I swear, bro, my editor always leaks my credit card every single video. There's nothing I can do about it. But yeah, I just created a private server and it should be pretty easy to dress up like this. I guess the first thing we need to do before we even buy any clothes is to change our display name to Weakest Dummy. This is actually gonna look real because you can put spaces in your display names out. So there's literally no way for them to differentiate this account and the actual dummy. Another thing I need to do is buy like a fake health bar to put above my head. So I'm just gonna go on the catalog and I'm gonna search up a health bar. This one right here looks pretty solid. So I'm gonna add it to my cart. And then the next thing we need is some hair. This should be pretty simple to find because it's literally just Goku hair. So we're gonna go over to the hair and we're gonna search up Goku and yeah, literally the first one right here in the search results looks pretty solid. The weakest dummy also has like a sad face right here. So I'm literally just gonna search up sad in faces and okay, I'm not paying 900 Robux for that. Honestly, this face right here looks close enough to the one that the weakest dummy has. So I'm gonna add this to my cart. How much Robux is this so far? 185! Please like and subscribe, guys. I'm gonna go broke. I've already spent half my budget. But I'm pretty sure now all that I need is a suit. I'm gonna try to find the exact one the weakest dummy has on his outfit right now. Okay, how come the second that I open the catalog, there's just immediately a suit right here? Is Roblox listening to my microphone? You know what, Roblox? If you can hear me, freak you, Roblox. All right, I couldn't find the exact one, but I found this black suit shirt, and then I found some matching pants. So I'm gonna add both of these to my cart and the uh, uh, 195 Robux. Okay, I can afford that. Let me just buy the items. Now I'm gonna equip everything. Bro, you guys are not ready to see the amount of drip I'm about to have on this avatar. Well, let me just go ahead and reset really quickly and show it to you guys. They are going to 100% believe that this is the weakest W. Look at this outfit, bro. Everyone rate the drip 1 through 10 in the comments. Hold up. Well, let me compare this to the actual dummy. This is spot on. I've never seen something look more accurate. The health bar might go through my 
my hair, but that's fine, guys. It doesn't even matter. We're looking just like the weakest dummies. So now it is time to join the server and spy on my girlfriend. We're gonna see what she's doing with Turkish Quandale Dingle and most importantly, her ex-boyfriend. I just refreshed the servers and they're still in there, bro. They, they are still in there. But I am now about to do my hardest mission in this video, which is getting into the server and successfully replacing the dummy without them noticing me. <laughs> Once I load into this server, if they see me, it is over. My entire plan will have failed if they see me in here. So I'm currently hiding behind this tree and the weakest dummy is right there. I need to come up with a plan to get them far away from the weakest dummy and I think I have an idea. Someone just got serious punched. I'm gonna type one of those like fake admin messages in the chat. Bro, this is such a cool trick because you control any of your friends with this. Basically, what you wanna do is you wanna flood the entire first bar of the chat with hashtags and then you're gonna put something like a global message in brackets and I'm basically just gonna trick them into thinking that there's like a new strongest egg inside of that tunnel right there and they're all gonna run over to it and they'll probably be distracted over there for a while and then I can replace the weakest of you. Yeah, it looks like there's an actual global message that just got announced to every single server. Josh just said yo and Anna said what? Tunnel now and they're all running over to there. Okay, this is perfect bro. This is perfect. Now I can walk over to the weakest dummy right there and just replace him. So while they're over there doing whatever they're doing, I'm going to just push the weakest dummy all the way across the map. He's down to like half health, so I just have to wait for his health to regenerate, which is kind of annoying. I think I can normal punch him one more time without killing him, and okay, I think he's far away enough. No one is gonna find the weakest dummy over here. Now all that we have to do is just run over to the middle of the map and just stand right here. And yeah, I look exactly like the weakest dummy now, bro. I look exactly like him. And now I literally just have a hidden camera in the server. I can free cam and then spy on them and see everything that they're doing. Actually, I have a really good idea. This might be my best idea that I've ever came up with. What if I pretend to be like an interactive weakest dummy and then I get them to play a game of truth or dare? I could just destroy them and they don't have to answer so many questions. Okay, hold up. Now I'm just gonna type in the chat global message. The egg is ran out when there's a new interactive weakest dummy in the middle of the map. They just all immediately came to the middle of the map. Anna said, OMG, what? And Josh said, yo, they updated finally. Quandale Dingle said, wait, a new dummy? And Anna said, save us. Yo, what is she doing? No, nah, I'm literally screenshotting this, bro. I'm literally screenshotting this and saving it to the folder to screen share to her later. Josh just said, hey, yo, and Turkish Quandale Dingle said, nah. And of course, Anna said, I bet you like it, the wink face. Bro, what is even going on? Turkish Quandale Dingle said, bro is a NPC. And Anna said, even better. Yeah, we have not even started the truth or dare yet. I haven't even gotten them to admit to anything weird and they are already acting like this. Josh just turned to Anna and said, I thought you were only supposed to do that with me. Okay, hold up. I'm screenshotting this as well. What does Josh mean by that? I'm starting to think she's actually cheating on me with Josh, bro. Turkish Quandale said, she can only do it with me. Josh said, what do you mean, bro? She's mine. Nah, bro. I paid 50k for her. I've been gifting her nitro for five years. Nah, gifting a girl Discord nitro for five years is crazy, and she's literally just watching it, and she said, ooh. You know what? I'm screenshotting this as well. Why is she ooh-ooing in front of other guys? That's weird. I got her three cars and two phones. Bro, that's where she got the car. Bro, just went bark, bark, wolf, growl. Turkish Quandale said, bro, I will beat you up. She's mine. And bro, they are now having a freaking bark off in the chat. Okay, this is insane. Anna just had to derp face. See, Anna likes it when I bark. You know what, bro? I'm gonna start barking in the chat too. I don't even care. And Anna literally said it's so hot and sent three drooling emojis. And I was saying, yo, the new weakest dummy is finally updating What? Oh, I forgot that I was even barking back at them in the chat. Okay, hold up. Now they're just mad at Anna for calling the weakest dummy hot. All right, you know what? Let's get them to play the game of truth or dare now. And I'm going to get them to admit so much stuff. Hello, I'm the new interactive weakest dummy. I've been added to the game to help new players who are trash and dog water at the game. And Anna is literally just typing drooling emojis. And Josh said, yo, Anna, stop drooling. Okay, like, dead ass, what is she even typing in the chat? You know what? It'd be kind of weird if I played truth or dare immediately. So I'm just gonna ask if any of them want to 1v1 me. And then after we've done the first 1v1, we'll start playing truth or dare. Anna said, yeah, I want to fight you. Bro, of course, Anna wants to fight me first. But I just asked her what moveset she wants me to use. And she said, Tatsuwaki. And then she said, actually, Ugg, that's the stupid moveset that Mango always uses. I hate Mango so much. Bro, what? Now, I literally have this all on recording and I'm going to call Anna soon and just screen share this all to her. Why is she talking bad about me in front of the weakest of me? Now she's just counting down going like three, two, one, go. I genuinely don't know what's going on, bro. She tried to hit me with Stone Coffin so I just wall comboed her onto it. No, but like I'm genuinely scared to know what her answers are gonna be on truth or dare. But I'm just gonna pick up this trash can and throw it at her and now that she got back up, we're gonna wall combo her boy, and then we're going to hit her with 
crush it pull afterwards and you're dead that was too easy bro i'm literally the top g yeah let me just claim my one free emote and use it on her just gonna mop up her dead roblox avatar and okay anna's running up to me now and bro they're making fun of anna in the chat for losing to an npc but she just walked up to me why did she just type sniffs she said wow you're so good at the game you're even better than mango i don't know what turkish quandale dingle is doing over there he just said what mango is so trash for real mango is okay this guy's saying that his grandma can beat me yeah th that is cap but i just asked him in the chat do you guys want to play a game of truth or dare so that we can get to know each other better turkish quandale dingle said sure and anna said yeah it would be so fun let's play it bro my plan is working perfectly i'm actually such a genius okay i don't know what turkish quandale dingle just typed but i said how this is gonna work is we're all gonna do a free-for-all and whoever wins gets to ask each member of the server a truth or dare question and uh, i have to win this free-for-all because if i lose my entire plan will have failed and anna said please don't hit me hard and bro this josh guy is so weird he just said what if i want to like i still have no idea who josh is bro i'm pretty sure that's anna's ex-boyfriend but i don't know what he's doing in a server with her but you know what L let's just start this free-for-all i'm just gonna count down in the chat the free-for-all starts in three two one go and okay everyone is already fighting let me just get rid of josh and i think whenever we're playing truth or dare i'm literally just gonna ask anna if she's cheated on mango before and whenever we're doing the truth or dare i'm literally just gonna ask anna if she's cheating on mango with josh right now bro josh is literally so low bro he's so low oh i should have my ultimate here in a second okay let me just hit josh with windstorm fury and we'll get rid of him boink you're dead yeah let me just mop up your dead roblox avatar bro and quandale dingle got anna a little bit low so i'm just gonna steal his kill oh i have my ultimate now you know what how about i steal quandale dingle's kill and then go ultimate on him that would be so funny <laughs> yeah because i already have anna down to like half health she just dodged away okay yeah i'm literally getting her so low and quandale is raging he just said bro my kill no nah, that's my kill i'm just too cracked bro i'm too good quandale is so bad he just said bro i'm gonna make him even more mad by going ultimate on him now he just said you're so done i think the only person who's done here is you quandale dingle yeah let me just go ahead and use cosmic strike on him he's dead <laughs> wait cosmic strike only got him down to half health okay it's fine bro because i think they might have a passive move on tatsuwaki ultimate if i'm not wrong i'm not fully sure but boink let's do it once again and this should end his entire career bro turkish quandale dingle is going to be no more yeah let me just go ahead and emote on those bozos but yeah i successfully managed to win the free-for-all which means each of them now have to do either a truth or a dare josh just said dang this npc is kind of overpowered yeah it's almost like it isn't an actual npc but i'm just gonna ask them if they are ready to play truth or dare honestly i'm kind of scared to see what anna's answer is gonna be her and josh both just said yes honestly i'm just gonna ask turkish quandale dingle the first truth or dare i just asked quandale truth or dare and let's see what he picks he said truth okay i think i'm gonna ask quandale if josh or anna invited him to the server because if anna invited him then that means she's talking to another guy but if josh invited him i don't really have anything to worry about so we are going to ask him quandale who invited you to the server josh or anna it was the best got anna what now, why did anna invite him to the server why did anna just type blushes in the chat okay not nah, th this is weird okay i'm really hoping that anna picks dare because i have a really good idea i'm gonna try to get her cheating on me on camera so that i can confront her with it so i just walked up to anna and i said anna truth or dare come on bro i really hope she picks dare bro please pick dare please and okay perfect bro perfect okay i'm really nervous for this but i just said i dare you to smash josh and okay what's she gonna do bro what is she going to do and she just said say less it's her okay no and quandale is just flipping out over here i don't even want to look at that bro that is crazy i literally have that on screen recording i'm gonna call anna in a second and i'm gonna show that to her and she's gonna have some explaining to do guys turkish quandale dingle just said bro what the hell why'd you do that without me okay i just asked josh truth or dare and i really need josh to pick truth and okay perfect he said truth so i just typed is anna currently cheating on anyone with you and josh said yeah that loser named mango haha <laughs> okay no, no no i'm screenshotting this bro i'm screenshotting this okay i have an idea i have an idea i said anna i dare you to facetime mango and if she actually does it if she actually facetimes me i'm going to flip the camera around and i'm gonna show her that it was actually me in the server the whole time and anna said oh do i have to and josh said a dare is a dare quandale said the same thing you gotta do it um she's thinking about it bro i really hope she actually facetimes me because i will turn the camera around right away and just show her that i was in here the whole time and she said okay fine one sec okay i'm gonna wait for my phone to start ringing and hold up bro she's actually facetiming my phone right now oh hold up. okay should i pick up okay i'm gonna pick up guys i'm gonna pick up yo anna what's up yo why are you facetiming me 
Bro, I just muted on FaceTime and moved the camera away from my face. She's literally just like staring at the phone right now, not saying anything. I'm so confused. Okay, I'm gonna unmute and move the phone back. Yo, Anna, are you there? Yo, wh why are you just staring at the phone and not saying anything? Okay, you know what, Anna? You wanna act like this? I'm turning my camera around right now. It was me on this weekend dummy account the entire time. And bro, she just hung up on FaceTime and she left the game. Nah, bro, she just got caught in 4K. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I'll do a part two. Today in the strongest battlegrounds, I used the new avatar scaling update to make my avatar really small and spy on online daters. Watch the full video because I caught them typing some such stuff in the chat. They added an update to the strongest battlegrounds where you can change the size of your avatar look if i type slash size by roblox username and then 10 look how big my avatar is and i can also make my avatar extremely small i just gotta type the exact same thing slash size add a mango pool and then let's do like 0 0.1 look how tiny i am look at me next to the weakest w and i might be able to go even smaller yeah i can do slash size 0 0 1 and i'm literally like just invisible bro you can barely even see me and boys this gave me a really good idea i can use this size command to make my avatar super small and to spy on online daters and troll them. They're gonna think some invisible force is attacking them. So yeah, I'm just gonna join a public server and I'm gonna try and find some online daters and then I'm gonna try and get them into my private server because I'm gonna need to join into a public just to find some online daters and get them in my private server because I cannot use this admin command in public. So yeah, let me just load into a game. And yeah, we are in a server, boys. The server that I loaded into is pretty small, but I'm gonna see if there's anybody in here and okay wait hold up who are these people on the leaderboard why is there somebody named the drizzy leaks are so hot bro that username is so hot and wait sarah is in the server hold up is sarah have a new account bro what are the chances that i ended up in sarah's server if you guys don't know who sarah is she's this really weird tiktoker who i've been trolling for like the past couple months in her live stream hold up let me try and find where these people are because if i can get them in my private server and then spy on them with this small avatar bro this is gonna be so funny we're gonna catch them in 4k ultra hd and hold up i think that's them over there so i'm just gonna like walk up to them really quickly hold up, bro i'm just looking at like the past chat messages why did sarah say that to drake and why did drake say can i slide my stake of course only for you and drake said oh my god i can see it from the what is going on i'm gonna walk up to them i'm genuinely so confused right now bro like what is this guy's avatar why is he cosplaying as drake hold up i gotta hide behind this tree so that they don't see me bro bro why does this avatar have like poop stains on it there are literally poop stains on this guy's boxer i can see it what okay wait hold up they're talking about me now this guy just said you know that mango kid and she said mango fool sucks he said for real yeah, i was like trolling them as a discord mod in their live stream yesterday he made me get canceled we should get her get back yeah i literally got her banned off of tiktok multiple times i think her roblox account got banned as well because she is on a new account she's saying all of my fans money is gone Drake said, also, let me get that Giot back. Drake, that is crazy, bro. That is insane. That is diabolical. Look at this guy right here is just lagging it out. But yeah, I need to get these two online daters in my private server, bro. It would be so funny if I troll them with this new admin command and just make my avatar super small. Bro just said, so how are we gonna get back at him? You know what, bro? I'm gonna beat you up real quick. Point, bog, bam, pow. Yeah, I'm literally just gonna 2v1 them. She said, is that Mango? Yes, sir, it is. That's me. You know what? I'm gonna try and bait Sarah over to the wall so I can wall combo her hey sarah come over here sarah get over here one two three and then down slam and q get wall comboed bro i'm too good now i'm just gonna pull her over with this send her over with windstorm fury and then she's gonna get launched over there one two three and down slam you're dead sarah get noobed you're garbage and drake you thought i wasn't gonna fight you you think you and your glizzy are safe bro now get over here bro boy i'm gonna hit you with stone coffin you are not safe drake down slam and slam you into the wall bro these wall combos with tatsuwaki are so fun bro and drake just said all right you're gonna get a feel for the snake bro drake i do not want to feel the snake bro he's gonna hit you with explosive push i'm gonna hit you with windstorm fury as well point bonk bam pow bro just said that they don't call me drizzy for nothing okay bro you're sus bro this guy is sus bonk bam and then i'm just gonna hit you with the finisher you're 
dead! Let me know in the comments what you guys think of the new Tatsubaki finisher with crushing pull. Me personally, I think it looks sick. But yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and hit the gritty on them. And you know what? Let me also go ahead and mew on them. Bye-bye! Uh, yeah, make sure to keep up your mewing streaks, guys. But yeah, I'm just gonna stand on this bench and wait for them to walk up to me and start raging. Bro, I need to get these two goobers in my private server so that I can troll them with this new avatar scaling thing, bro. It's gonna be so funny. So let's see. Oh, they're both over there. You know what? I'm gonna walk up to them. Yeah, she's just talking to Drake about how I beat her up. I'll do it again! Who's gonna stop me? And bro, these people need to learn what not to do in a public server. Like, why are they running into each other's avatars? I was just said, I'm yachting bigger. She just said, what are you looking at? I'm looking at you guys being weirdos and Drake told me to get lost. And he said, nah, we cuties and just went back to it. She's saying Drake could do anything. Yeah, this guy just hit them. <laughs> okay, guys, I need to get them in my private server so I can troll them with the avatar scaling thing. So I'm just gonna type in the chat. Hey, guys, let's make a deal. And Drake said, I'm listening. And she just said, what weirdo? Okay, if anyone here is a weirdo, it's you. She's saying that I'm jealous of Drake. Okay, let me just type the deal in the chat. I'm gonna invite the both of you to my private server and if you manage to kill me once i will leave you guys alone forever so let's see what they think of the deal she said okay bet drake will beat you up and why did this guy bro hit them not me uh, she said that drake will beat me up grizzy said all right bet but i'm gonna warn you we got that pookie power and sarah's saying that i'm gonna go cry after this yeah sarah the only one who's gonna be crying is you after i steal drake wait pause hey yo yeah i just typed in the chat i'm adding you guys to my private server let's run it and now let me just leave the game bro i need to close my oh yeah i got my private server right here i'm gonna go over to configure and i'm gonna add them to it now i got both of them added to my private server so let's just go ahead and join and yeah i'm just gonna wait for them to load in bro it's gonna be so funny trolling them and also guys uh, while we're waiting i want to show you guys a cool little trick that you can do with this there's a certain avatar you can equip to make it where you have zero hitbox while you're doing this like no one is gonna be able to attack you at all so what you need to do is unequip all of your hats that are gonna make your hitbox bigger and you want to equip the junk bot torso if you guys got like 20,000 robux to spare you also want to equip the core blocks legs and then equip the city life woman arms and last but not least if you got like another 30,000 robux to spare uh equip the headless head you know this avatar only costs 10 robux like it says right here this avatar didn't cost 50,000 please like and subscribe guys i spent my life savings on this avatar but look at how big my hitbox is right now now without this avatar and then i'm gonna reset and look how much smaller my hitbox is now bro like if anyone hits me right here right here right here or right here no one's gonna be able to hit me at all this is gonna be super overpowered bro now if you guys don't have as much robux you can get a similar result just by using the city life woman package it'll still lower your hitbox by like 90 percent but yeah i'm just gonna switch back to my main avatar for now i'm not gonna troll with the smaller hitboxes until later in the video in the meantime while i'm waiting for these goobers to join i know a lot of you guys are gonna want to troll your friends with this new admin command so i'm gonna be giving out the private servers plus game pass to a bunch of people from my last video all you guys gotta do for a chance to win a game pass is like the video subscribe and then comment your roblox username as well as the secret word that's hidden in the video i don't have unlimited robux so i can't give them out to everyone but i'm gonna be trying my best to give them out to as many people as possible but yeah here's some people who commented the secret word on my most recent video i'm gonna gives private servers plus to this guy congratulations bro this guy right here also wanted private servers plus so i got you with the game pass i'm gonna give out some more game passes off camera because everyone has very low attention span but yeah i'll see you guys when these goobers load into the private server five minutes later okay it's been a few minutes and it looks like they both loaded into the server there they are over there okay i'm gonna do size adam mango pool 0.1 and let's run over and we're gonna see what's going on bro we're gonna spy on them real quick I'm just speed running over. Drake just said, what's good, Pookie Bear, to her? And Sarah just said, where's that dumb name, Mango? And Drake just said, wait. Yeah, odd. Hold up, I'm just gonna, like, punch one of them and see if they notice me. And Sarah said, he is scared from your big muscles. Bro, I'm not scared of little bro's big muscles. Hold up, I'm just gonna hit Drake a few times. 
time, so I'm gonna hit her, and I'm gonna see if they notice me at all. Drake just said, uh huh, I got hit. I said, tripped, bro. They're so confused right now, bro. They're literally so confused. Oh, yeah, well, hold up. I, I can just hide right here, and then if I look up, I have a perfect view, boys. No cap. She's just saying, you're making me scared. Is there a ghost? She's like looking around and like turning and looking at stuff. The yacht is staring me down. Bro, what does that mean? Bro, I'm literally just like hiding right here, yo. I wonder if she, if I jump, if she'll feel it. Okay, that sucks, bro. That sucks. She's just telling like, Drake to calm down. Okay, guys, I'm gonna like start beating them both up here in a second. But also, guys, there's another thing you can do. You can make everyone's avatar super huge so that they just have massive hitboxes. And since their avatars are so big, their hands are so high up, they're not gonna be able to attack you at all. So I'm gonna do that to them here in a second. And what is Drake doing, bro? All right, Drake, you're out of here, you little shit. Let me just hit you with Windstorm Fury. Bro, they're probably so confused right now. Boy, fuck, bam, a pow. We just hit you with a stone coffin. Bro, my stone coffin just went under the map. Oh my gosh, bro. I literally have like a perfect view of this dude's poop boxer. And Sarah's just freaking out. She's like, ah, and he's saying, where, what now? Okay, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna try and like wall combo one of them. Let me try and like push Drake over to a tree. <laughs> okay, we're like over in this tree. One, two, three, down slam, and then boink. Bro, it's actually kind of hard to aim wall combos. Hold up, one, two, three, four, and boink. Yeah, <laughs> I literally just wall comboed him with like a tiny avatar okay let me hit him with stone coffin now <laughs> he's just saying bro the server's haunted yeah one two three four and a boy can get wall comboed again i want to see if i can do like the finisher on him <laughs> bro he doesn't even know where i'm at he can't fight back either because if he punches he's not gonna reach my avatar i was testing this out earlier the only way to fight back is if you do like normal punch on saitama or something like that he's literally just punching the air strike to hit me nah bro you're not safe little man you and your snake are not safe okay ayo pause i'm just waiting for my crushing pool to finish regenerating because i want to do the finisher on him bro that's gonna be so funny <laughs> bro he literally thinks the server's haunted and sarah's just scared yeah let me just hit you with crushing pool and i literally said the finisher on him underground he's like trapped in the ground <laughs> Sarah, you're not safe either. She's just freaking out. She's like, what's going on? Sarah, you're not safe. Oh, boy. Yeah, let me just hit you with Windstorm Fury as well. Bro, I'm literally just like comboing both of them up. Yeah, let me just hit you with Stone Coffin. <laughs> Sarah, get over here. Boink, bug, bam, a pow. Yeah, bug. I'm too good at this game. Oh my gosh, bro. Explosive push is so cool with this. And I just long into the air. What the flippers, bro? Hello, I want to try omnidirectional pushing them here in a second. I'm going to like switch to sides of them. <laughs> yeah, let me just hit you with Stone Coffin. Yeah, I'm just gonna wall combo you into the stone. Oh my gosh, I just got flung into the sky. Hold up. No, no, I, I don't. Oh no, I just respawned with like my huge avatar. No, 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 no. Hopefully they don't see me. Okay, okay. I, I don't think they saw me, bro. Okay, I don't think they saw me. And bro, they're just typing in the chat, where is Mango? Where is that loser? Tell Mango to fix the server, please. I'm scared. No, I'm not gonna be fixing the server. You guys are not gonna be leaving the haunted server anytime soon. Okay, the next thing I wanna do before I make their avatar super huge and troll them with the hitboxes is I'm gonna quit quickly switch to Saitama. And I want to try like death countering one of them or like omnidirectional punching them, bro. That would be so funny with like this small avatar. I wonder what it would even look like, bro, if you omnidirectional punch someone. Oh, and bro, I also wonder if you could change the size of the weakest dummy. I'm going to try that here in a second. But uh, let me just farm up my ultimate off of them. Bro is grabbing a trash can. He's just flexing to his girlfriend how strong he is. OMG, that muscles, I want you to smash me with that. Okay, sir, first you need to learn English before you start yapping about all that. But I'm just going to beat them up and like farm ultimate on them. They're just like, how? It's back. Yeah, let me just hit them with all the directional push. I'm gonna uppercut Sarah. Drake, you're not safe either, bro. Look how quickly my ultimate bar is going up. Boink, oh, let me just hit both of them. Let me hit you with Ken Subble DB bop and punches. And I literally already have my ultimate, bro. Wait, I'm gonna try picking up a trash can, bro. Look how big the trash can is compared to my avatar. Hold up. Bro, this is so funny. I'm not even holding the trash can. I'm literally just like pushing it around the map. I wanna see what happens if I try throwing this at someone. Let me just throw it at Sarah. Boy, oh, I literally just, like, shot the trash can. All right, who put that in my pants? Drake, you're sus. Okay, I got my ultimate, though, so I'm just gonna activate it. I really want to death counter and omnidirectional punch them, but I really want to throw a trash can at them as well. Hold on. Let me just push this trash can over to them. I think I hear something. Yeah! 
But wait, bro, that trash guy just hit both of them. Okay, now I'm gonna omnidirectional punch one of them. Hey, Sarah, get over here, Sarah! <laughs> bro, I literally just omnidirectional punched him. My avatar is so small. It literally looks like, like some invisible thing is omniing them. Oh my gosh, bro, this is so funny. Hold up, I want to death counter them as well. They're still just freaking out. Drake's like, a how? What the? Yeah, buddy, you're not safe, bro. You're not safe. The Drizzy is not safe. Wait, before I death counter them, I have another funny idea. I'm gonna make Drake sh shorter than his girlfriend and death counter him in front of her it's just to make him look super weak in front of his girlfriend okay i'm gonna make him like shorter <laughs> and look bro his girlfriend's literally taller than him and bro she's just saying ew i don't like short guys and he's just saying wait what okay hold up hold up i'm gonna form my ultimate off of her and then i'm gonna death counter drake like right in front of his girlfriend bro this is gonna be so funny drake's freaking out in the chat he's saying it wasn't like that before <laughs> you were a liar i had feelings now you're short <laughs> okay i'm just gonna uppercut her you know what? Let me farm my ultimate off of Drake real quick, too. Let me just hit Lilla, bro, with normal punch. My ultimate bar is, like, one shot away. I'm so close to getting it. I'm not gonna send the pics that I promised. Hold up. Should I try and get her to send them to me? Okay, no, no, no. That's not happening. Boink, bong, bam, pow. And I got my ultimate. Drake says, I promise it's still big. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. But, yeah, I'm just gonna pop my ultimate, and I'm gonna wait for Drake to start, like, punching around. Okay, I just said how to Come on. Yeah! <laughs> Bro, he literally just got death countered by, like, an invisible small avatar. Whenever he respawns, I'm gonna make him even shorter, and I just fell out of the map. And he's just respawned. He's raging. He's saying, what? How? That's so dumb. I'm gonna size him, like, 0 0.7. Bro, she's just raging in the chat. He said, wait, what? My snake got smaller? No. Okay, that is, that is crazy, bro. And Sarah just walked up and said, haha, look how small you are. <laughs> look at that, bro. He's, like, a whole five feet shorter than her. Okay, now I'm gonna make Sarah, like, really big, and her hip Box is gonna be huge, bro. It's gonna be so funny. I just sized Sarah 10. And of course, Drake is just spamming Giot in the chat. <laughs> Let's see what Sarah said. Drake just said it. That's a huge. Okay, that's crazy. And now Sarah's saying, no, you gotta pay, not for free. Okay, so since her hitbox is so huge, I can literally just knock her on the ground. I want to see what happens when she's like ragdoll the boy. Okay, I don't think this is gonna work very well with Saitama. I think I'm gonna have to like switch to Genos or something. And yeah, I'm just gonna start shooting at her. <laughs> Her whole avatar just started ragdolling and Drake's like freaking out. Yeah, boy. We just hit her with ignition burst. Bro, this is so overpowered, bro. Her hitbox is so huge. And Drake just said, wait, it's this goober. Yeah, look how short you are, little man. I'm just gonna hit her with blitz shot. And oh, okay, no way. She just countered me while she's like that huge, bro. But yeah, I can literally just like punch her and ragdoll her, bro. It is so funny. Boink, bong, bam, a pow. Yeah, Sarah, you're garbage. You're trash. And she can't even fight back. Like, look when she punches, bro. She's not not gonna be able to hit me yeah she literally can't hit me at all because of how high up she is wait bro she's so low bro she's literally like one shot boy bog bam pow you're dead and look at little man right here he just said that's it if i can't see the guy i'm leaving sarah just walked up and said "Ooh, mango you're looking fine what a smash that guy okay sarah that's insane and she's trying to kiss my roblox i was her i'm good i'm out of here what the so guys i just joined the strongest battlegrounds and i was gonna record a video when i see this guy on the play List with zero kills named Mango Pool, and I looked at his account. Not only is he dressed up as me with the exact same avatar, but his username is Real Mango Pool YouTube. Like this guy thinks he's actually me. Yo, chat, is this even real? Like I need to search up bro's username, Real Mango Pool YouTube, and check this guy's profile out because that is crazy, bro. It's just pretending to be me. Dude, there's a YouTube channel linked on here. Wait, if this is like some fake YouTube channel of me, I swear. Okay, no, it's my actual YouTube channel that he has linked. The display name on his account is. The exact same as mine. The avatar is the exact same as mine. The only thing he got wrong were the animations. He sent me a friend request. If this video gets 5,000 likes, I'll accept his friend request. All right, boys. Bro, he's even in my Roblox group. He doesn't even have my rank. Which, if you guys haven't joined my group, you should definitely join it so we can reach 100k members. We got a bunch of merch in here, and I'm gonna have some new merch dropping soon as well. You know what? Like, quick shout out to everyone who's bought the merch recently. If you guys see your username on here, you're the best. Comment down below letting me know if you see your yourself on here or not i'm gonna be shouting out like everyone who buys the merch in my videos sometimes but bro looking at this guy's profile again he, his bio says a real mango fool from youtube with over 400 000 subscribers huh? be sure to unsubscribe from my channel dislike my videos and gift me game passes okay why would i tell everyone to unsubscribe from my channel and dislike my videos and i already have over 8 million robux and every game pass in the game i, I don't need anyone gifting me game passes well hold up it says read more right here also 
know my game is dog cheeks and you should dislike it as well. Bro, is he hating on Circus Tower Defense? Bro, Circus Tower Defense is literally the most goaded game on Roblox. You guys should definitely play it if you haven't yet. Yeah, this guy's a freaking goober. Let me just reopen Roblox and find where this guy is. I need to go and confront him and I'm just getting beat up by some noob right here. And bro, I see him right there with a bunch of like people surrounding him. Hold up. I'm just gonna hide behind this tree and let's look at what he's doing. There's like three people over here. They're saying OMG Mango Pool. OMG OMG. Bro, that isn't even me. That's a fake Mango. Real question mark? And he's just saying yo. Yeah, I'm real. And this other girl is saying OMG Mango. She can't even spell my name right. Fake fan. And he just said a sub shoddy. You got that yacht. Okay, bro. This is like some random bacon hair. What is bro talking about? Can I tap? Okay, this guy is actually bro. This guy is insane. He's like freaking out typing random letters in the chat. I am subbed. And he just said, why are you subbed? I hate my fans unsub right now. Yo, I don't hate my fans, bro. What is he talking about? I hope I never hit 500k subs. Everybody like and subscribe right now. We're gonna hit 500k in no time. Why so negative? I'm depressed sad face. Bro, I would never go up to my fans and be like, guys, I'm so sad and depressed. Like, why would I say that stuff to my fans? Have you tried talking to someone? Are you emo now? Okay. And he said, no, but there is one thing you can do to help me. Emo pool moment? Sure, what is it? Bro, I'm not even emo. What are these people talking about? If you guys buy me all the game passes, I'll feel better. I need a real fans would. Bro, bro, I already have every game pass. If you buy me them, I'll buy them back. Promise? That's not me. I would never say this to my fans. What? Will you get me Atomic Samurai? He's my favorite. And bro just said, sure. And he's freaking out. He's saying yay in the chat. Okay, I'm gonna get my mom's credit card. Be right back. And he's telling the bacon hair girl to get her mom's credit card too. <laughs> and she said, okay. Yo, why would I ever tell my fans to grab their mom's credit card and spend money on it to buy game passes for me? Like, that is actually delusional, bro. I would never say this. She said, okay, since I'm a big fan, here's my mom's money. And Atomic Samurai Bacon is freaking out. He's like, I got it. I got it. And this guy's walking up to me. Nah, bro, I gotta step in before this goes any further. This is insane. Like, what is going on? <laughs> and Bacon Atomic Samurai just said, what the hell? Double. And the girl said, two mangoes? And the fake mango is saying, question mark, who are you, little bro? Dude, who are you? This guy right here thinks he is actually me. I'm Mango Pool. Who are you? And then the bacon hair girl said, oh, um, but which one is real? And Atomic Samurai Bacon said, this is confusing. I already lost track of the ones I was talking to. I'm Mango Pool, the real one. Bro, no, you are not. I am the real one. This dude is a poser. Lil bro wishes he was me. Ain't no way I am being called a poser. This guy just said, what the flip? And now his messages are getting tagged. Bro, this bacon hair is just saying swear words at me. What is bro's avatar? He looks like baller with an an angry constipated face. Bacon, am I Gojo when he got caught by Toji? I am feeling something. Ain't no way. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Fake Mango is saying, bro, go away. I got business to attend to. You're ruining my vibe. What business do you have to attend to? Scamming my fans? I'm recording a video gifting stuff to fans. And he's talking to this random guy saying, back up, bro, stop hitting me. And bro just hit him again, and now they're getting into a fight? Bro, no way. He's just jumping him. No, they got into like an actual fight. Okay, bro, I'm gonna have to stay in the server just to make sure that these two people don't give the game passes to the fake mango pool over here. Bro, they're literally just fighting each other. And no, this guy's getting destroyed, bro. The fake mango is actually beating him. Why did this guy get destroyed? Why is the fake mango actually good at the game? He just said he's lagging. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, bro was totally lagging. Garbage, I am the top G. Bro, you're not the top G. You're the bottom L. Nobody likes you. You're adopted. You weigh 752 pounds. Told you guys I'm real and they're freaking out saying, OMG, man. Mango destroyed him. Bro, this bacon hair said, stay away from my pookie. Bro thinks he's like dating the fake mango. The girl just said, OMG, mango, this is why I'm a big fan. And now he said, anyways, you guys need to gift me game passes so I can gift you some back. Bro, he is not gonna gift you any game passes. He is trying to scam you. Lil bro actually thinks he's me. And the bacon hair girl said, okay, about to gift. And the other bacon said, buying right now. Bro, guys, stop it. Don't gift him. He's a scammer. And she just said, question mark. Fake mango said, Nuh uh. Bro thinks he's like really beating the allegations by typing nuh uh in the chat. Bro, I gotta be high right now. There's no way. Yeah, you're stupid as hell thinking that this is the real mango. You probably smoked like 50 gallons of weed, bro. This is my rating of your trash off brand outfit, and he rated my outfit a four. That's higher than any girl you've ever talked to has rated you, so I'd say that's a pretty high rating, buddy. And the bacon hair girl is saying she doesn't know who to believe. Bro, it's me. I'm the real 
one. I wish that Roblox gave me like a star code or something so that I wouldn't have all these impersonators. But Roblox will give me one. Like I guess I'm a brand risk to them or something. He's saying me, I'm real. And the bacon is saying, I swear. Bro is actually swearing. He's just typing hashtags in the chat. I am so dumbfounded. Yeah, I am too. Like what am I witnessing right now? Hmm, Mango doesn't swear. Yes, I fucking do. Are you stupid? All right, listen, little man. If you're the real Mango, you should be able to beat me in a fight. Let's 1v1 best to three. And he said light work. Okay, the first move set I'm going to be 1v1ing him with is Metal Bat because this is like the GOAT move set. You're going down, Trash Pool. Bro, the only thing that's going down is my Metal Bat into your sister, bro. I don't know what you're talking about. Let me just hit you with beat down. Bro is already emoting like he won the game. Blood is emoting like he won the game. He thinks he actually won. Like, you're about to get destroyed. Let me hit you with Grand Slam and you're already below half health, bro. You were already down to half health, buddy. Yeah, who was saying light work, no reaction? Who wasn't typing light work in the chat? He said, chill, I wasn't ready. I don't really care if you were ready or not, little bozo, because I'm ready to destroy you and I'm just getting beat up by some random guy. Like, bro, I'm in the middle of a 1v1. The whole server is just attacking me. But you know what? I'm still gonna win. We just hit this guy with home run and then we're gonna hit him with grand slam right after. Boink, bonk, bam, pow. And yeah, everyone just jumped him and he's dead. So you know what? I'm just gonna emote on little man. Take the L, bozo. I just won my first match out of three and this guy said bye-bye faker. They're all emoting on him. And he just typed angry face emoji in the chat. No way some random guy is asking the fake mango to 1v1. Little bro says that doesn't count. Your goon stepped in. Yeah, the whole server was jumping this dumbass. It was actually kind of funny. <laughs> you can't 1v1 for real. You need help, brokey. And this guy is saying true. No way this guy is siding with the fake mango. Like, are you stupid? They're just having like a conversation. They're both preying on my downfall. He said, I know, right? And yo, this guy just grabbed the trash can. Yo, he's about to throw it at one of us. I don't know who he's throwing it at. Um, bro, he threw it at me. Mango pool is so trash unsub. Like, why is he telling the whole server to unsub for me, bro? Like and subscribe right now, guys. And we are going to hit one mil easily. And Goat said, y'all got a 1v1 no third party. Okay, let's do that, bro. I'm just gonna hit you with my beatdown. And bro, the guy who said no third partying, it's just normal punch us across the map. What the hell do you mean no third partying when you're instantly attacking us right when the 1v1 just started? He's saying, stop it. I wasn't ready. Bro, I don't really care if you weren't ready. Like, I'm ready to destroy you. So that's all that matters, buddy. And he's hitting me with explosive shuriken. Bro is using Sonic. Like, this guy has to Sonic spam in order to win a fight. And he still can't even take the W. He loses every single time. I just hit him with that. And now we're going to hit him with foul ball. Boink. Fling you into the sky. Now let's dash over. Hit you up with some M1s. Bro is just blocking. And okay, they literally just killed him with that attack. And he's calling me a cheater in the chat. He said, bro, OMG. This man is actually raging, bro. It is so funny. And someone just incinerated the entire server. You know what, buddy? How about we go to my private server? Since everyone is third partying. So no one sees you lose? Bro, I will invite Atomic Samurai Bacon and this E-Girl Bacon to the server to watch as well. Don't want to cry in front of others. And these people are asking to watch in the chat. Yeah, I will invite both of them to the server. I want to see this go down. Yeah, we'll invite both of them. They can come watch this fight. Okay, I just typed to the chat that I sent the invite to all three of you. Join up. And bro, I just pulled up the server list. It looks like all three of them are already here. So let me just join up. And you know what, boys? I'm going to be using the Atomic Samurai Game Pass for the next 1v1 because this moveset is about to be complete. And bro, I'm so excited. Let me know in the comments if you're excited for this weekend. Hopefully the update will be out. And yo, what is this guy doing to the weakest of me, bro? Uh, this guy's like a fan of my channel he's being sus like bro you gotta calm down I, I don't know if this is what all of you guys are doing to the weakest w but this guy needs to chill and uh, what is the fake mango pool do okay they're literally having like a threesome with the weakest w yeah this game makes me lose brain cells man i don't even know what's going on this guy is talking about chris brown in the chat honestly this guy needs to get some sense chris brown into him i blowed harder than when i see tatsubaki bro no way you guys think that that is actually me okay that is something i would say i'm not even gonna cap i can tell he is the real mango I know I am. Okay, bro. I don't even know what's going on. This guy hasn't even fought me yet. And these two people are already saying like, oh yeah, he's the real one. Now that your pugs are gone, are you ready to have a legit fight? Uh, yeah, bro. I'm ready to destroy you. The first two didn't count. Okay, I'll still beat you three more times. Light work, no reaction. Like, this is gonna be too easy, bro. Uh, apparently I cheated, like always, because there were some people in a public server that were also jumping him because they think he's stupid as hell. And Atomic Samurai Bacon said, do we still buy the game passes, Pookie? 
the e-girl said is so do we still buy them and he's saying yes buy right now hurry and okay i'm saying no don't buy until after the 1v1 because i think after i beat him three more times they will probably realize that he's fake hopefully and atomic samurai bacon said okay mm, fake mango has a point i guess Bruh. he's stupid don't listen to him and bro just started attacking me okay you want to do the first 1v1 now buddy we can do it we just hit you with pinpoint cut and he canceled out my movement scatter bro is actually a professional sonic spammer you know what let me just counter bro with split second counter yeah dude the animation for this is so cool i kind of want to kill him with a split second counter because dude the animation on that is so cool and he is just blocking my moves with sonic i don't even know what just happened there bro is lagging also i know a lot of you guys will comment like guys mango pool uses admin commands too much i will not use a single admin command in the fight with this bozo because i know i can already beat him let me just throw a trash can at little bro this guy is a little bit better than some of the other toxic people who i fight like he's actually getting a decent amount of hits on me but he's still missing quite a bit too like i don't know this guy isn't really as good as he thinks he is let me just smack little bro up though and we are about to have him at half health boink bonk bam pow i just hit you with atmos cleave gonna smack you up with some m1s and he's saying stop it bro is begging for mercy yeah you're still gonna lose buddy you are not him you're adopted we throw this trash can at you as well you're already so low bro i think i just need to get a few more hits on him and then we are gonna finish him off with split second counter bro it is gonna be so funny okay you know what i'll let bro get some free hits on me you know what I i'm feeling generous we gotta give back to the poor you know what I i'm gonna hit him with split second counter and bro we just finished him off oh wait okay never mind we didn't kill him yet i, I thought i had him low enough but i guess i didn't let me just smack bro up a few more times and wait for my cooldown to be over and he's saying stop cheating okay hold up hold up i literally just need to get like one more shot on him let's do split second counter and bro he just got destroyed bro look at that animation that was so sick and he just said no in the chat yeah bro is raging heart bear and atomic samurai bacon just said no nah, ain't no way yeah there is no way you just got destroyed that badly he's growling at me and saying i got lucky but we have two more fights i'll get my get backs okay bet let's do the two more fights buddy oh i'm not allowed to use atomic samurai anymore because it's too overpowered okay you know what to ensure that this fight is as fair as possible he's using deadly ninja so i'll switch to it as well you guys already know i'm a pro at sonic you know what i'm even gonna be nice and i'll ask him if he's ready because apparently last round he wasn't just typed in the chat all right little man you ready to lose again like the disappointment to your parents that you are and he said yes okay what is he trying to make me look bad or something i know mango pool is a disappointment for real like he's typing this stuff in the chat and these idiots still think that it's me <laughs> bro is just like oh in the chat i hate myself unsubscribe from me and please give to me game passes so i don't off button myself yeah bro actually thinks he's gonna get game passes and they're like crying in the chat <laughs> i still see your shadows in my room bro is like typing juice world lyrics in the chat i mean he said he's ready for the fight so i guess i'm just gonna start hitting him boink and he's saying hey bro stop you said you were ready what do you mean stop yeah i don't know what is going through little man's head bro is just a little bit dumb bro is a little bit goofy in the head let's hit him with another trash can and okay he dodged it he said ha ha guess what uh what <laughs> you die yeah i think you're the one who's about to die oh, oh no he just popped his ultimate bro he really just popped his ultimate okay hold up hold up i'm just gonna have to run away from him really quickly and bro really just missed his first shot bro how are you missing all of your ultimate shots this is embarrassing he says stop moving yeah not only are you a disappointment to your parents you were a disappointment to the people who think you're the real mango pool bro is actually missing all of his shots he got ultimate and just started throwing bro is selling he had an actual chance to beat me and win one of the fights and he just screwed it completely over he screwed himself over so bad okay wait i'm actually at half health he landed like his last shot so let me just hit him with scatter and explosive shuriken and then i'm gonna pick up this trash can that has your name on it and i'm gonna throw it at you and you're down to half health so now i'm gonna hit him with whirlwind kick he is still telling me to stop in the chat no trash cans okay i won't use any more trash cans for this low and v1 and i'll still win like bro you were already one shot you were already so low i'm just gonna hit you with scatter and a boink bonk bam pow let's smack you up with some m1s we'll hit you with explosive shuriken and dude he is actually so low he's literally one shot he's one shot right now let me just run back up to him and let's hit him with flash strike he said leave me alone bro i think that's what all the girls say to you whenever you're within a 10 foot radius of them this man is the reason that all the girls on tiktok carry around pepper spray and atomic samurai just said omg i have no words this isn't fair looks like i beat you best two out of three you lost little man you're trash and atomic samurai bacon said i think this is the real one tbh this other guy is getting smoked like my grandpa did um i'm not gonna question that last part that he just said um but yeah he is getting smoked and a little bro is growling at me if i lose so do they uh what does he mean by that 
<laughs> Bacon just said, what? And yo, he's attacking my fans. Bro, you are not gonna attack my fans. I am not gonna let them take that disrespect. Yo, get back over here, bro. I'm just gonna smack you up again. Gonna hit you with scatter. And my fan just said, Mango help in the chat. Yo, yo, this guy really wants to attack my fans. Nah, bro. You are not going to disrespect my fans like that. Okay, this guy's coordination is horrible. He's attacking the wrong Mango. You know what? Let me just hit the weakest W really quickly until I get my ultimate because it would be so funny if I popped ult and did it on him. I think I just need to kill the weakest W like once and then I should get it. And let's go. We got it. Okay, uh, where is bro at? He is attacking my fans again. You know what? Let me just puff my ultimate and kill him. Let's just activate it on his dumb ass. And he just said, oh, no in the chat. No. Yeah, are you ready, bro? We're just gonna smack you up with twin blade rush. Bro is freaking out in the chat. This is worse than when his Roblox girlfriend left him. Yeah, bro is actually freaking out. Okay, boink, bonk, bam, pow. Now I'm gonna hit you with carnage. And bro, you are dead. Yeah, let me just emote on you. And if you guys want a chance to win an actual game pass, comment how many hidden pictures of Pokemon were in this video. And bro, it's all like Samurai just said, you've got to be the real one. That is wild. He's still saying he's the real one. But yeah, any last words, fake mango? This isn't the last time you'll see me. I'll be back one day. And he left the game. They added wall combos in the most recent Strongest Battlegrounds update. And I think I have the perfect idea on how to use them. So I looked over at my private servers and I see Daiwei with Sarah and the Nobby girl from one of my last videos. So basically the plan for today is to dress up like a complete noob, act like a complete idiot. And then we're just gonna start destroying all three of them with wall combos. It's gonna be so funny because they're all three toxic as hell. So yeah, let me just quickly like wear this bacon hair avatar and then uh, save it to Roblox. And now we should be good to go and enjoy this private server. Also, if you guys haven't seen this yet, there's a little bit of a secret wall combo that we are going to be trying out later. <laughs> but yeah, I see them all over here. I'm just gonna hide behind this tree and then we're gonna like shift P and spy on them real quick. And yeah, Daiwei is literally just chilling over here with his two girlfriends. I cannot believe that Daiwei has two girlfriends now. That is insane. Like, just look at Lil Bro. How does he have this much raise? Daiwei just said, I'm viewing and edging so hard right now. And Sarah said, Mango is so bad, he should never hit 500k. Okay, what is Daiwei typing in the chat? Yeah, that guy sucks so much. Okay, you know what, boys? Everybody like and subscribe right now. We are going to prove them wrong and we are going to hit 500k in no time. I'm about to end all three of these people's edging streaks, bro. I edged to Mango losing subs. Guys, we are gaining subs out here. Let's prove them wrong. Yeah, you know what? I edged to be wall comboing both of Daiwei's girlfriends. You guys are about to get destroyed. Okay, wait. I just realized that sounded very sus. Oh, yo, that is not what I meant, guys. That's not what I meant. But yeah, let's just, let's see what else they're saying. And then I'm just gonna walk up to them and I guarantee they're gonna like bully me because I'm a bacon hair. And then I'm just gonna pull out my wall combos and we are going to destroy all of them. I don't know what Daiwei's doing. He's just beating up Sarah and oh, okay, they're like kind of near me. Hopefully they don't walk up to me and find me in the server. But bro, I cannot wait to use these wall combos. Sarah just said, Daiwei, you are so strong. Chris Brown is my role model. Okay, that is insane, bro. Sarah just said, I love him heart eyes and she got flung across the map. Okay, Daiwei actually just equipped with the Chris Brown moveset. That is insane. Frick Rihanna. Okay, Daiwei is gonna get me canceled, bro. He's actually gonna get me canceled. Yo, are they walking up to me, bro? Are they walking up to me? Um, it feels like someone is watching us. Who this? Let's edge on him. Um, who the hell is this poor on? Who were they found me? I didn't even get a chance to walk up to me. And what? What is Nami doing? And he said e-girls jump him. And now both of them are jumping me. Okay, since I'm pretending to be a noob, I'm just gonna let both of them kill me right here because it's gonna make it so much funnier if they just think I make a complete noob with no skill and then I just start wall comboing. You know what? To make myself look like even more of a noob, hold up, hold up. Let me dash out of this and just start missing all of my hits. Boing, bog, bam, foul. I'm like punching the air. <laughs> hold up, hold up. I wanna do normal punch into the air as well and die way canceled out my move. Hold up, hold up. Bro, they literally killed me so fast. They just like in 3v1 me. Nah, bro. They are not ready for when I pull out my wall combos, dude. They are not ready. It just said, bro is trash so bad, LL. I know, right? So easy. Okay, that's about to be me saying this to you guys here in a second. Bro, look at all of these dumb high school dropouts. Like, I encourage all of you guys to drop out of high school too, but these people are really stupid. I think I peed my pants. Like, die, wait. We don't need to know this information. Bro thinks he's mango fool lol. Oh, they saw my display name. Wait, yeah, fake mango. Now Daiwei said, who wants some limited IP by pants? Oh, okay, what the hell? He reeks of rotten oranges. Is that seriously your most creative insult, you dumbass? Why are you trying to be my cringe brother? Bro has zero bitches. Daiwei, look at you. These two e-girls are probably only here because you paid them Robux. I have 9.6 million Robux on my account. 
I can steal your e-girls light work no reaction okay I think I'm gonna let them kill me one more time where I pull out my ultimate <laughs> because this time die wish is jumping me bro are they all using metal bat like you guys are seriously so bad at the game that you have to spam with metal bat bro this is embarrassing okay never mind Sarah is using Garu just you guys wait they, they might have killed me right there but I'm going to pull out my wall combos and end their entire career Sarah is saying keep hitting me die way I love it and die way is like emoting what is Nobby doing okay this is like the weirdest private server I've ever been in <laughs> and now she's like flexing all of her money I'm living my dreams through okay die way this guy's gonna get me demonetized like YouTube is not gonna put any ads on this video because of this little weirdo over here but yo I think I'm just gonna try to get Nobby over here super low and then I'm gonna wall combo her so hold up hold up let me just jump her we're gonna try and push her over to this wall I'm gonna get her down to one shot and then just finish her off with a wall combo boy we just uppercut you into the sky let's dash over and start comboing her hit her up with consemplative big pop and punches we'll do a shove we'll dash into her back her up with a few more m1s and let me just get her down to like one shot okay okay i think she should be low enough right here so let's just hit her one two three four and then dash and yeah we just wall comboed her bro oh my gosh dude i just like sneezed into her bro she is so low and die way is just coming over and trying to steal my kill you are not gonna steal my kill you little bozo die way's raging he said bro that was my woman and sarah said it's okay you have me pookie and die was just saying only i get to kill her you know what die way you're next and oh i have my ultimate bro okay it would be so funny if i just wall combo him and then pop my ultimate and the bro really just let me lead him over to a wall also guys i have this secret wall combo that nobody really knows about so we're gonna test that out later die way is just saying stop yeah buddy i'm not gonna be stopping anytime soon but yeah i really want to test out the wall combos with these different movesets because that would be so funny okay okay hold up hold up one two three four dash and oh oh okay i killed him way too early so i did not even get to do the wall combo on him and they both just said no okay yo you two idiots are gonna get omnidirectional punch into the sky boy you guys are both trash garbage you suck at the game yeah let me just fly up into the air bro i love the omnidirectional punch move so much sarah it is over for you she just said how dare you yeah sarah is raging so much right now she is not having it today you're dead and since i just killed both of them you know i got an emote on their dumb asses oh and daiwei is attacking me okay i kind of want to let daiwei still think that i'm a noob so i'm gonna let him kill me and then after he does that i'm gonna switch movesets bro if you guys thought the side to a moveset was crazy just wait until you see the other wall combos that are in this game and daiwei is just saying haha he's laughing at me okay buddy just you wait daiwei just you wait daiwei just killed me and sarah just stopped on me they're like all emoting around okay so the next character that i'm gonna switch to is hero hunter bro these bozos are not ready for my wall combos okay so daiwei's distracted fighting sarah over there so i'm just gonna walk up to nobby and then i'm gonna hit her with flowing water boink bug bam pow let's combo her up we're gonna hit her with a hunter's grasp next and i just need to stay near a wall so that i can do the wall combos once i have them super low let's hit her with lethal whirlwind stream bro i'm straight comboing her Wink bonk bam pow you let's hit her with praise peril oh, okay she did not fall for my counter she she's a little bit smart i'm pretty sure i fought her in one of my recent videos she was like the leader of some anime girl only clan but yeah let me just push her into a wall okay okay here she is right here once she gets back up we're gonna hit her one two three four and then a dash how did i miss that and we did it this time bro the wall combo for that is so funny we just finish her off let me smack her into the ground with hunter's grasp and oh sarah you want to go you want to go sarah and Bro, Sarah immediately countered me. I'm not taking that disrespect, Sarah. Get over here. Get over here, Sarah. We just punched you. Gonna hit you with a hunter's grasp. And okay, Sarah, stop dashing around. I'm literally going to destroy you. We are going to put her in her place, okay? Sarah thinks she can come back to TikTok. Thinks she can get all of these simps. Nope, not today. She's already down below half health. We're gonna hit her with flowing water. And let me bash back over. These people are all so stupid. Like, they're just letting me corner them into a wall. They're standing here camping. And she said, get Get away creep okay one two three four and then just dash into you and wall combo you again now we're gonna hit her 
flowing water once again and she is dead she's saying only Daiwei can beat me up like this okay so yeah Sarah is crazy and bro why is Daiwei just sitting in a chair bro thinks he's Sneeko watching all of this go down this is my Sneeko chair bro Daiwei that is crazy bro is just sitting in the Sneeko chair watching all of his e-girls get destroyed he just said how you do what you do tell me uh what does Daiwei mean by that is he talking about like the wall combos and he said don't play games with me monkey how you attack on a wall it's a secret trick that only the most skilled players know okay i think they're about to start attacking me in a second so i'm gonna switch to genos before they do and bro that genos wall combos are so funny oh, okay and daiwei is jumping me up that is exactly what i predicted but we got genos watch this boys the genos wall combo is going to be so sick they're all just like chilling pretty close to the wall and daiwei is saying more like trash player okay you know what daiwei this next wall combo is gonna be on you let me just hit you with machine gun blows we'll smack you up again dash over boink bonk bam pow you're garbage daiwei you're trash let me just hit you with blitz shot you want to run away yeah i'll jet dive into you you're not gonna be running away today buddy let me pick up this trash can oh, okay the trash can is broken but it's all good because i'm gonna pick this one up throw it at daiwei and he is already below half held your garbage and he said stop doing that yeah i'm gonna jet dive into you again let's smack you up with the bullet shot too and okay he is already so low um uh, what is bro just doing at the wall like these people are so dumb let's just dash into him oh, okay how did i mess that up look genos is like way harder one two three four and then dash and we hit him we got it with the wall combo dude the genos one looks so cool yeah and okay sarah is trying to steal my kill you know what sarah you're gonna get wall combo too yeah how about i wall combo you up as well you little ran through tiktoker e-girl dumbass yeah sarah you want it you can have it sarah you can have it you idiot sarah is already almost below half health the hardest part is just keeping them on the wall but so far they haven't realized my strategy because I, I think these idiots are too dumb to know what wall combos are and oh, okay hold up hold up hold up hold up i need to fling her into the wall again smack her up with machine gun blows and okay she's one shot okay she's so low one two three four and dash and what? bro is not chris brown yeah i don't want to be chris brown okay let's try this again one two three four and boink dude i hate these wall combos you know what that next move set you're dead sarah and okay die way just popped this ultimate on me um you know what i'm just gonna try my best to dodge all of his moves he already missed that one uh die way you are literal garbage bro and he seriously just missed savage tornado as well okay now nah, he hit me once but i'm just gonna dash out of it and not take any damage bro okay bro die way die way just chill bro chill dude hold up i'm just gonna escape our answer i need to wait like four seconds and he killed me bro it is over my entire career is over but you know since i died that means it's time for a new move set so this time we are using deadly ninja also known as the sonic move set so let me just dash over i haven't seen the wall combo for this one yet so i'm kind of excited i'm just gonna pick this trash can up and throw it at them and okay never mind i saw the nobby e girl like right here so i'm just gonna combo her up i'm gonna try and lead her to a wall this should be a lot easier since i have scatter and i can just like knock her back with the explosive shuriken so let's hit her with whirlwind kick and bro she's already so low okay i think i'm gonna start running to a wall because she's probably gonna follow me yeah she's running at me and she said oh you're so annoying yeah i think the annoying person here is you but we're just gonna keep comboing her up wink fog bam pow i'm still gonna try and miss some of my shots because i want them to think that i'm a noob i want them to think i'm like a noob who just knows how to wall combo but so we're gonna hit her with scatter as well and okay um i accidentally killed her and she said you're so bad how are you gonna call me bad when you just died and they both walked up to me he said whose lost kid is this bro leave your trash okay you know what Daiwei wants to talk all this back you know what buddy you're getting wall comboed yeah let me, let me just push you into a wall okay we need to do one two three four and then dash and bro first try we did it first try oh dude this sonic one looks sick okay let's just keep hitting him we're gonna do this again i want to get him like super low and then finish him off with it he just said what and he's like raging at my wall combos he's like smacking me into a wall with his metal bat not nah, get over here bro get over here i think he's trying to do the combo but he just sucks at it okay hold up hold up dash it's we did it first try again bro he's so low i'm just gonna keep wall combo going hold up i'm gonna do it like back to back again okay i just need to combo him into a wall like again and i missed my shot right there one two three four and yeah dude this is so funny i'm just wall comboing him over and over and over again one two three four and dash okay i messed it up that time you know what you're i'm just gonna kill you with scatter bro i'm literally just gonna finish you off right here you're dead buddy and since i wall comboed you like 20 times i'm just gonna go ahead and emote on you look at my money stacks look at my dollar bills and bro sarah just typed spits in the chat no way she is spitting on me nobody wants your saliva and nobby said 
also spins. Okay, I don't know what is going on. The next moveset I'm going to be using is Metal Bat, and I heard this one looks really cool. They're just saying jump him, and then Sarah said anything for you, and she is popping her ultimate, bro. She is literally popping her ultimate right now. Okay, bro, I, I think I'm going to die. Honestly, though, that's a good thing that they killed me, because I don't have to wait for the 10-second cooldown over and over again to switch movesets. Really quickly, before they hit me again, I need to switch to Metal Bat, and okay, I'm going to try and get one of them over to the wall right there. And Daiwei has his ultimate. Oh, you think I'm gonna fall for that, bro? You think I'm gonna fall for that, buddy? Oh, no. He, he might actually kill me, bro. He might actually kill me. The Metal Bat moves are overpowered. Yeah, they're all missing so many of their shots, though. Like, did they all just pop their ultimate at the exact same time, bro? That is kind of funny. And they are literally just hitting each other. <laughs> bro, I just need to lead one of them over to a wall so I can hit them with my Metal Bat. Hold up, hold up. I kind of want to do it on Sarah this time. So I'm just gonna run up to Sarah. We're gonna hit her with Grand Slam. We're gonna hit her with Foul Ball. And we're gonna try and get her to run away from me like over there she just said ew this creep is so bad elter you were literally sipping for me like four days ago what do you mean a creep okay let's fling her over to a wall with that uh Daiwei just threw a trash can at me and he said to leave my pookie alone uh Daiwei, i think i'm gonna do what i want buddy i don't think i'm gonna listen to you so yeah i'm just gonna keep bleeding sarah over to a wall let's hit her with home run into a wall again <laughs> and okay okay we should be good we should be good she's just trying to run away from me and oh, okay she just countered me and she said get away okay one two three four and a boink dude metal bat is so hard to hit like i was trying to do it earlier but it's so difficult okay one two three four and no oh! and okay i hit it this time bro we flung her into a wall and that looks so sick bro that looks so sick yeah sarah you're dead you're garbage it's over for you okay look at look at both of them over there what are they doing are they just like emoting on each other okay yeah you know what one of you guys is getting wall combo too you know what that way let, let me just fling you over to that wall again just gonna do beat down it's kind of funny because all of these moves just lead them over to a wall and he's saying bro leave they're literally in my private server he said you're so annoying are you lost oh you're literally in my private server i think you guys are the lost ones can't even go in your own server and bro we just flung him straight into a wall okay one two three four and a dash yes dude i thought i missed that for a second but we actually landed at that time okay let's dash over let's hit it with beat down once again and he canceled it out and he wall comboed me okay how did i do that yeah he doesn't even know how he wall comboed me <laughs> bro i think i have admin yo yeah you totally have admin die with guys i still can't wait to do this secret wall combo because there's this one wall combo in the game that nobody knows about and you have to have some certain things in order to be able to do it so yeah i'm just gonna do the atomic samurai wall combo and then after that we are going to do the secret wall combo that nobody knows about it so let me just switch to blade master blade master should be free within like three or four days of the time that i'm uploading this so if you guys are hyped for blade master let me know in the comments because i know i am i should be able to use atmos cleave and pinpoint cut to lead them over to a wall so i see them all over here i think i'm gonna do the wall combo on sarah this time hi sarah what's good let's just hit her with pinpoint cut if you try to counter me yeah that's not gonna be happening sarah dude pinpoint cut flings them across the map so far i just need to get her into a wall oh you want to dash away from me sarah you want to dash away how about i hit you with my quick slice and then i'm gonna run up to you and i'm gonna hit you with atmos cleave we're gonna go straight into the wall where you belong sarah yeah look at sarah one two three four and dash into her first try she said bro hop off already yeah i'm gonna be in this server for as long as i want and sarah countered me okay you know what sarah see this trash can right here with your name on it you know what i'm gonna throw it at you because it looks just like your roblox avatar to be honest she said a hop off yeah i'm not gonna be hopping off one two three four and let's do it again bro i think can we kill her right here oh no she's literally one shot though one two three and a dash okay we literally killed her before i could even do the wall combo and Taiwei said this will teach you and then pop this ultimate again okay you know what i'm gonna hit it with split I can counter and wait you can't counter that move oh, I thought you could counter that move okay atomic samurai isn't as overpowered as I thought it was but it is now time to do the secret wall combo on them and Daiwei is saying haha idiot okay I'm just gonna let him kill me so I can switch movesets and uh okay I'm dead but now boys and it's time to switch to the sorcerer moveset also known as gojo so that we can do this secret wall combo now that we have the gojo moveset I'm gonna try and lead Daiwei over to the wall I haven't seen the gojo movesets wall combo yet by the way guys i just know that it has a wall combo another 
Another trick that I realized is you can throw trash cans at people and it'll launch them back in the air if you guys want to lead someone to a wall. So watch this boink and he just went flying backwards. Okay, now uh, let me just do infinity. And honestly, if I do infinity, I can probably just like push him over to a wall. He's not going to be able to move at all. And Sarah's trying to attack me, but she can't. She just said, boom. And she's calling me a hacker. Okay, I'm just going to hit him. One, two, three, four, and dash. Okay, hold on. This will probably be easier if I turn off my infinity. One, two, three, four, and dash. And okay. Okay, bro, this combo is like broken. And okay, we did it on him, bro. That was so funny. Yeah, we just ended Daiwei's entire career with these wall combos. So this spoiled e-girl somehow got into my private server and she would not stop flexing. Like she sent me a face reveal just to flex her Gucci shirt. So after this, I decided to destroy her in a 1v1 and she got so mad that she called her dad to join the server. I thought this was fake, but as you guys will see in the video, it is actually her dad on the account. Like guys, just watch until the end because this video gets crazy. So there's this e-girl in my private server right now. I don't know how she got the link or anything. I'm pretty sure I accidentally leaked it in my live stream the other day. But I'm just gonna join and we're gonna 1v1 her because I just think it'll be fun to 1v1 her for the video. So here she is right here. She's walking up to me. She said, question mark, who are you? What do you mean, who am I? You're the one in my private server. She's claiming that it's her private server and to get out, you're that trash YouTuber. Okay, I'd like to see you make a YouTube channel. I'm so much richer than you. I literally have like 7 million Robux. What is she talking about? I'm more famous than you. Yeah, she probably has like 20 followers on TikTok. You know what? Let me just destroy this e-girl in a 1v1. I'm gonna hit her with foul ball and then grand slap. Yo, she's running up to me. All right, let me just hit her with beat down. How did that miss, bro? Okay, I'm gonna hit her with home run though. And yeah, yeah, we hit her that time. She just went flying across the map. You just missed your shot so bad. Yo, she's already so close to half health. Yeah, let me just beat her up real quick. Okay. Okay, bro. Okay. Nah, there is no way she wins this, bro. There is absolutely zero chance that she wins this 1v1. You know what? How about I let her get some free shots on me? I'm feeling generous. Yeah, you can just smack my avatar up real quick. I know you keep missing all your shots, so I'll, I'll stand still for you. All right, I'm actually really low. I need to stop letting her get free shots on me or I'm actually gonna lose this. But let's hit her with a home run now, bunk. Yeah, let me just pick up a trash can and I'm gonna walk up to her and throw it at her. Oh, I can see her running towards me. Bong, you are actually dog water and i'm gonna hit you with beat down and your entire career is over i just destroyed you that was too easy now i'm gonna go ahead and emote on you let me just do the shuffle emote bro she's telling me to go touch some grass looking at your avatar i don't think you've taken a shower in the past 49 years aren't you the one who was at the zoo earlier but got mistaken for a beluga whale that escaped its cage she's telling me to leave her private server or else yeah what are you gonna do i will call my dad on Honestly, that would be pretty funny to talk to him. Does he have Roblox wish chat? <laughs> she said, yeah. And he will beat you up? Okay, considering that she's really bad at the game, I don't think her dad is that good either. But bro, that's gonna be so funny if she calls her dad into the server to fight me. Like she can't even win her own fight. You know what? Just to make her even more mad and to get her to actually call him, I'm gonna pull out some admin commands and troll her. Now, the first thing I'm gonna do is this glitch with private servers plus. It will lag the entire server no one is able to move or anything basically you just need to pull out your auto clicker and you're gonna spawn a bunch of weakest dubbies so i'm just gonna spawn every single one like i'm spawning the attacking dubbies the blocking dubbies the normal ones and bro i just have an entire army that is spawning into the server and basically what this does is it makes it where the other person cannot move at all like if you don't have a really good monster pc you're just gonna be lagging a ton like as you guys can see if my frames are even dropping like crazy like if you even go near the weakest dummies bro you're gonna be lagging a ton and she just said in the chat why can't i move yeah bro this is perfect now i'm just gonna switch to atomic samurai i'm gonna give myself the instant awakening and then let's just run over to her she says last chance i will call my dad okay call him i want to have a word with him yo i'm gonna convince him to put her up for adoption in roblox voice chat that seems like it'd be pretty funny and now we're just gonna beat her up let's hit her with quick slice and at this cleave boy now if you guys are excited for atomic samurai's full ultimate to release this weekend let me know in the chat she's calling me a hacker i'm just gonna activate my ultimate really quickly and boy yeah <laughs> Bro, there's only like two moves right now. I wish that Atomic Samurai Ultimate was complete. That would be so funny. But let's just hit her with Sunset. And bro, she is one shot. She's dead. She says, no, I can't move. Okay, 
Okay, yo, yo, yo. I'm gonna spawn kill her real quick. Bro, the server is lagging is so bad that the dubbies aren't even showing up. Let's hit her with the sun blitz and let's do sunset one more time before my ultimate runs out. Bro, I love this moveset so much, bro. It is actually so cool. You're half health already. Let me just smack you up with my M1s, boink, bonk, bam, pow. And we're gonna do quick slice on you. She's saying stop in the chat. She's actually so mad, bro. She is so mad. <laughs> yeah, how about you call your dad? How about you get him in the server to come fight for you? Because you can't win a fight yourself. Okay, I'll clear all of the dubbies now so that she stops lagging. Because I kind of feel bad for that last round, bro. She just immediately died. And she said, I can finally move. Hacker, my dad will wreck you. My dad owns Roblox and he is way richer than you. Mm -hmm. He totally owns Roblox. Yo, imagine she calls her dad and it's just Builder Man. That would be so funny. You are nothing but a brokey and in real life i wear expensive things my whole closet is full of gucci that's how rich my dad is all right then how about you get him in the server like where is he at she said trust me i will what's your instagram i will send a picture of me wearing all of my gucci i'm gonna open instagram and just see a picture of like a beluga whale i just got a fifty thousand dollar gucci bikini okay that is wild who would spend fifty thousand dollars on that uh if you guys want to follow my Instagram, it's Mango Pool YT, but I'll just type this in the chat and <laughs> wait until I get a DM from her. But bro, it's gonna be so funny once she gets her dad in the server. Because like the way she's talking, I think her dad is Bill Gates or something. And bro, we are gonna talk to him in Roblox voice chat and convince him to put his daughter up for adoption. And she said, Okay, let me take a picture wearing my Gucci. Alright, while well, she's AFK taking a picture, bro, I'm just gonna beat her up because I wanna make her so mad that she gets her dad in the server because bro, it is going to be so fun whenever I troll both of them. I guarantee I can beat them in a 2v1. I just switched to Sonic because it has been quite a while since I used this moveset. Like, it's been a minute. And I'm just gonna hit her with Explosive Shuriken Bong. I might be a little bit rusty because I haven't used this in a little bit, but I'm just gonna combo her. Let's do Flash Strike right after. And she's already down to half health. Bro, this is actually like the easiest moveset ever. Bro, they need to nerf Sonic again. Boink, bonk, bam, pow. Bro, I wonder how many times I can kill her before she comes back bonk now let's hit her with explosive shuriken and that was too easy bro that was too easy she just walked up to me and is like wow i was afk why did you kill me i was just practicing well whatever check dms oh no did she actually dm me a picture of her wearing gucci <laughs> oh okay wait let me check and bro she said this no she's actually wearing like a gucci shirt and bro the bathroom that she's in is like a huge also is she in like a mansion Bro, I thought that she was lying, but she's actually wearing a Gucci shirt. <laughs> See, I'm so much richer than you. How down to me, you broke peasant. <laughs> and I think I'm gonna hit the gritty instead of bowing down to her. <laughs> and she just said rude and started hitting me. Oh, she said that her dad is joining the server. I will not be taking any more of this disrespect. I am a queen and I will be treated like one. <laughs> Yo, I guarantee I can kill her two more times before her dad joins. We just punch her real quick, boink bonk bam pow oh you want to try and block me yeah we're not gonna play that game i'm still gonna win yeah let me just hit her with uppercut and let's do conceptually be bop if punches i'm not gonna lie boys i'm not as good with side to butt and she's using metal bat which is kind of overpowered but i think i can still win this bro there's still a chance let's hit her with normal punch and can subtly be bop if punches also guys i don't know if i mentioned this earlier in the video but comment how many hidden pictures of pokemon you see as well as your roblox username and what game pass you want or a chance to win a giveaway and stuff. You know, it's 2024. We're gonna be doing a bunch of giveaways this year. She's already down to half health. You're garbage, Madison. You're trash. I'm using a moveset that I'm not even good at and I'm winning. Let me just hit you with consistently bump and punches again. And I missed that, bro. I thought she was gonna land where I was hitting. It is all good. I've never taken an L before in this game. I've never taken an L. I'm still gonna win this. I just hit her with normal punch and I'm gonna hit her with consistently be bump and punches. She just missed like seven M1s. I don't know how that happened, but she's literally one shot, bro. She is a 
about to die. I think I can just punch her once. And yeah, she's dead. Yeah, let me just go ahead and emote on her. And yo, no, her dad loaded into the game. He has 12 kills. Bro, I can't believe her dad is actually in the game. Okay, he's walking up to me and he's asking why I was bullying his daughter. <laughs> My little sunshine is very special. Uh, I wasn't bullying your daughter, bro. She's just mad that she sucks at the game. Also, guys, I have a really funny idea. So what I'm gonna do is after I destroy Madison in front of her father, I'm gonna dress up as Madison and start typing horrible, horrible things in the chat. And we are gonna get Madison put up for adoption. All right. If Madison isn't put up for adoption by the end of this video, I will upload it. My daughter is not terrible at the game. You will not disrespect her. <laughs> do you know who I am? I only know who you are because I was in your wife's bed the other night and she said she hates you and wants a divorce. You will not disrespect me or my wife. I'm a multi-billionaire. I was not even a multi-billionaire. He's just a multi-billionaire. And Madison just said, Dad, if I win in this 1v1, will you buy me another Gucci purse? And he said anything for you, sweetie. Bro, that is crazy. Your daughter is not gonna win. She sucks at the game. Want me to prove it? And he said, yeah, you can't prove anything. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Hero Hunter, which is the moveset that I have the least skill at. I suck at Hero Hunter. And I guarantee that I'm still gonna beat Madison in this fight. I could also beat them in a 2v1, like, easily. But bro, I cannot wait to dress up as Madison and get her put up for adoption, bro. You guys are not ready for the horrible things I will type in the chat. You know what? I'll even give Madison a countdown. Three, two, one, go. And I'll let her have the first 10 seconds. She can hit me as much as she wants. I'll let her get, like, so many free hits on me. She just missed that shot. You suck at the game, Madison. You missed two shots in a row. How are you missing all of your shots, Madison? Oh, you hit me once. Good job. All right, Madison, your 30-second starting time is up. Oh, okay, she literally just jumped over my flowing water, but she's missing every single one of her shots, bro. Okay, let's hit her with Lethal Whirlwind Stream, and boy, you just got slammed into the ground, Madison, your garbage. Now I'm gonna hit you with Whirlwind Grass. No, that's Hunter's Grass, not Whirlwind Grass. I'm stupid. Let's hit her with Flowing Water, and she just keeps jumping and missing, bro. Like, her missing her shots is making me miss my shots. That is how bad she is at the game, bro. I know I was using some admin commands earlier, but I'm not even using them right now, and she has her ultimate. Okay, no, 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 no. No, I need to actually run away, bro. She has ultimate. Bro, what is she just standing there for? She hasn't even hit me once. Okay, watch, watch, watch. I'm gonna throw this trash can at me. Bonk! Oh, Madison, you were actually so bad. Okay, she's doing Savage Tornado. Oh, no, she actually hit me with it, bro. She actually hit me with it, but she did, like, no damage. Bro, I don't know how she has her ultimate, but cannot hit a single shot. Like, that is actually embarrassing. Oh, no, I almost fell for her counter. Bro, Kiwi is typing in the chat that his daughter is destroying me. Bro, she is not letting a single shot. What do you mean that she's destroying me? Oh, you wanna jump in? You wanna try and punch me? Oh, bro, this is a 1v1. You are not allowed to join. Yeah, Madison's ultimate is literally gone now. She did not let a single shot on me except for right there. Okay, now that Madison's ultimate is gone, it's time for me to combo her. She's already nearly at half health. That is insane. Like, Madison, genuinely, how are you this bad at the game? This is embarrassing, Madison. This is literally so embarrassing. This trash can right here has your name on it. Bunk. She said, let me win. I need that Gucci purse. Madison is not getting that Gucci purse. You just died and I'm gonna go ahead and emote on your dead Roblox avatar. Okay, now it is time to dress up like Madison and start typing horrible, horrible things in the chat. And oh no, wait, 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 wait. Kiwi is walking up to me. <laughs> bro, Kiwi's raging at me in the chat. He says, you will not hack in a 1v1 against my daughter. <laughs> bro, Madison says, I lost my Gucci bag because of you. I hate you. I'm crying right now. Are you happy with yourself? Bro, I am very happy with myself. I just made her lose out on a Gucci bag. Ha ha ha, El Bozo, no Gucci bag for you. <laughs> just gonna emote on her, <laughs> no Gucci bag, ha ha. You are making a girl cry. How are you dancing over that? Bro, she thinks it's like a, so I'm gonna report your Roblox account for making fun of a real life tragedy. <laughs> yeah, do you know how bad that is? Oh, guys, this is such a tragedy. This is worse than World Hugger. She didn't get a Gucci bag. Now she has to wait until her birthday. Yeah, I have to wait two weeks for my Gucci bag. And Kiwi said, you know what, Madison? If we can beat him in a 2v1, I'll give you your Gucci bag early. Bro, she's just raging at her dad in the chat. I still can't believe you're only giving me a Gucci bag, though. I want a golden Rolex watch as well. Okay, you know what? Since it's a 2v1, let me just start beating them up. Boink, bonk, bam, pow. Oh, yo, Kiwi is just going in already. Bro is, like, hitting me with consistently bopping punches. Yo, 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 yo. Kiwi might actually destroy me. Okay, Kiwi, calm down, bro. Calm down. Let me just hit him with shove. Bro just got flung across the 
map. And bro, Madison is just attacking Kiwi. Are you stupid, Madison? Are you dumb? All right, let me just beat up Madison. Okay, bro, how did she even jump over that? I swear, bro, she has like the worst aim ever watched. I'm just gonna throw this trash can at her and you're already down to half health, Madison. Okay, bro, no, 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 Kiwi. I know you did not just throw a trash can at me, bro. Madison, how did you miss that badly to where you hit Kiwi? All right, I'm just gonna keep beating up Madison. Bro, she actually landed a shot for once, guys. Can you guys just comment? Everybody comment, congratulations, Madison. That's her first time ever doing that. She's just missing the rest of her shots now. Let me just uppercut her into the sky. Boink, bonk, bam, pow. Madison, this is actually embarrassing, Madison. I don't know how you're this garbage in the game. She just jumped into my can suddenly be bop of punches. And bro, how did she get her ultimate? How did she get that? And she's already missing all of her ultimate shots. Like, Madison, how are you this bad? I genuinely don't understand how you can be this bad at the strongest battleground. And her ultimate is already gone. Okay, it's time to just beat you up. Let's get you back down to half health. Bunk. And bro, that was so quick. Oh, I have my ultimate. Okay, you know what? You know what? I'm just gonna death counter her. Okay, watch, watch. <laughs> Death powdered. Oh, Bozo, you're garbage. Just gonna hit the gritty on her. Okay, where's Kiwi at? Oh, here he is right here. All right, boink. Pro's raging at me for killing his daughter. All right, let me just hit you with Kinsubble be Bob and punches. And you're already below half health too? Oh my gosh, bro. I guess it just runs in the family being horrible at this game. Like, this is literally a 2v1 and I'm destroying both of you. This is why you don't mess with the top G, bro. I cannot wait to dress up as her though and get her put up for adoption. What's Madison typing in the chat? She's just raging at her dad for not winning and bro he just died that was too easy she's still raging about how she wants a rolex too <laughs> yeah let me just emote on them but bro i will never understand why people buy rolexes when you could buy like two houses bro like you could buy two houses do all that stuff but you buy a watch instead like bro who even uses watches anymore just look at your phone dumb and bro there's arguing in the chat he's like this is all your fault if you weren't so terrible at this game you might have actually gotten the gucci bag if you weren't such a useless sack of multi potatoes you could have finished him up okay i'm just gonna dress up like madison and we are going to type some horrible stuff in the chat guys just gonna finesse her outfit and catalog avatar creator bro he's not gonna even be able to tell who the real one is and who the fake one is so let me just reload into the private server they're still arguing with each other in the chat bro this is so funny okay so it'll be pretty obvious that i'm the fake one if i walk up there because someone will have just walked up so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go in the admin panel and then i'm just gonna spam the respawn button over and over again until I spawn next to him. And okay, there, there, I respawn next to Kiwi. And I said, wait, how did I respawn? And he said, I don't know. Is there a hacker in the server? You probably did something dumb. Oh yeah, I forgot they were arguing. And bro, Madison's right there. Hold up, hold up. She's walking up. Let me, let me just kill her real quick. Bro, I need to get rid of Madison. She, she can't notice, bro. She can't, she's probably so confused right now. Why are you dressed up as me? Nah, bro, she could not notice. Let me delete just kill her. And bro, she's dead. Okay, okay, let me just run up. I don't think that her dad saw that. Okay, Madison's gonna be so bad when I just type this. Also, I don't want a Gucci bag. Matter of fact, donate all of my Gucci bags to the homeless shelter. I don't want a Rolex either. He said, okay, I'll donate them all tomorrow. From now on, I only want you to buy me cheap clothes from Walmart. And bro, Madison's spamming in the chat. That's not me. It's fake. If you donate my Gucci bags, I will go back with my- I'm pretty sure he's too dumb to open the Roblox chat up here i think he's only reading the chat bubbles that i type i just said by the way can you send me to the adoption center tomorrow and he said yeah sure bro no way today in the strongest battlegrounds a fan messaged me and told me that she got scammed i had her give me some information about the scammer and then i went undercover and found out that this guy was actually the leader of one of the biggest hacking groups in the strongest battlegrounds i decided to sneak into their hacker group to scam all of them but things took a turn and got crazy you you guys won't believe what happens. Watch until the end to find out and also stick around to hear about how you can win some game passes. But with that being said, let's get right into the video. Guys, I just got a message on Discord from a fan and it said Mango Pool. I just got scammed in the strongest battlegrounds. I'm so sad. This was my first time getting Robux, but a scammer stole all of my game passes. I heard he's also scammed tons of other people. Please help. And guys, I feel so bad for this person because like I remember my first time ever getting robux like seven years ago i was so happy the first time i got robux and if i got scammed i would be really sad too so i'm gonna get this person in my private
private server. They're fine with me recording this and making it into a video. And we're gonna see if we can learn some information about this scammer. And I'm also gonna gift them some game passes. So yeah, I'll see you guys when they're in the private server. Okay, it looks like she's just loaded into the private server. There's her username right there, Lily. I'm gonna try and get some information about this scammer because honestly, guys, I feel really bad. Like, yeah, she literally had no Robux before this. I just told her, like, before I asked her about this scammer, I'm gonna gift her a game pass. Which one do you want? She said, can I have early access? Yeah, I got you. Like, any game pass you want, you can have. Oh, she said she's always wanted it. Yeah, I feel really bad that she got scammed, guys. And I got you with early access. Enjoy. I'm also gonna gift some game passes to some of my subscribers really quick. If you guys wanna win a game pass from me, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel, like the video, and then there's gonna be a secret word hidden somewhere that you have to comment. This guy right here wants early access, so I got you. Enjoy your game pass, bro. We gift it. This guy right here wants private servers plus. I got you, bro. Enjoy your game pass. And this guy wants early access. If you guys also want to win a game pass, just watch the full video. I'm gonna have a secret word somewhere. And yeah, it looks like Lily equips Metal Bat. Yo, enjoy your Metal Bat. She said, OMG, thank you so much. I've always wanted this. No problem. I got you. Thank you for supporting the videos and subscribing and everything. Everyone, sub to Bango Pool. Yes, sir. Yo, thank you so much. But yeah, let's get some information about this scammer. Guys, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like scam the scammer back. Next time I get Robux, I'm gonna buy your merch. Yo, really quickly, let me shout out everyone who's been buying the merch. Huge shout out to all of you guys who buy the merch. Like, I could not do all of these giveaways without you guys. I really appreciate it. You guys are the best. But yeah, I'm gonna interview her and uh, we're gonna see how this scammer, we're gonna try and get some information about him. I just asked her how she got scammed. This guy told me he would double my game passes if I gifted him, but then as soon as I gifted, he left the game. Bro, I feel so bad, dude. That happened to me one time, like, in trade hangout. Like, I traded this guy some items, and then he left the game. Yeah, I, I was, like, a dumb nine-year-old, and I got scammed. I'm gonna ask her, do you remember his username? Uh, let's see. Yeah, his name was Josh. I'll DM you a link to his profile. Okay, okay, that, that should be good. If we have his profile, then we should be able to get into his game and scam him back. I'm gonna ask her, is there any more information about him that I should know? Yeah, I think he's part of a hacker group, so be careful. Bro, there are a lot of people who just claim to be parts of hacker groups, but they're not. Like, I'm gonna be fine. I have a really good security system implemented, bro. Nobody is gonna be getting into my Roblox account anytime soon. But yeah, I think what I'm gonna do before I join him is I'm gonna make a brand new account because this guy is probably gonna recognize me if I'm on my Mango Pool account. He's probably gonna think I'm recording or something. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make a brand new account. Thanks for giving me this information about him, Lily. I'm gonna go and see what I can do. Okay, thank you so much. Keep me updated. Yeah, Lily, I will keep you updated. Let me close this game and we're gonna go set up our new account. Bro, I was not Googling pictures of Pokemon. This is fake, bro. My editor literally like edited this into my video. Yo, editor, we are going to cut that out of the video. We're not keeping that in, okay? But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and set up a brand new account because I really don't wanna blow my cover and join on my main account. I'm gonna be born on July 25th, 1995. That is uh, totally my real birthday, guys. As you guys know, like, I'm actually 28 years old. Dude, why do I have 48 friend requests on Fortnite? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna name this account Detective Mango Pool because everyone knows that that's not my actual username. So he's probably just gonna think I'm like a fake Mango Pool. And then the password, yo, maybe I'll show this password somewhere in the video. I don't know. I'm gonna buy some Robux on the account. So if you guys want the account, I don't know. But yeah, let's sign up. And yeah, now that we have this account, I'm gonna pull up Josh's profile and let's see if he's in a game right now or not. So here's this guy's profile. Bro's name is Sweaty Bob 2324 Okay, that username is crazy. And yeah, she wasn't lying. This dude is literally just pretending to be a noob. He's dressed up as a bacon hair right now. I guess he's like pretending to be a noob to get free game passes and then scamming people. Now, it doesn't look like he's in a game yet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for him to load into a game. But while we're waiting, I think I'm gonna fix up my profile real quick and make it look legit. So once again, I'm gonna have to buy some Robux on this account. Let me just give Roblox my credit card information. You guys are not gonna see any of this. I already know if you guys knew my credit card information, you would just buy a ton of Robux using it, and then I'd be broke and homeless, and, um, yeah, that wouldn't be good. But, yeah, we got 400 Robux, so let me just customize my avatar really quick. I'm gonna make, like, a detective outfit, since my username is Detective Mango Pool, and that's basically what I'm doing for this video. I am becoming a detective. So, let's buy this shirt, and- Oh, okay, it looks like there are, uh, some matching pants right here that we can buy as well. So, let me go ahead and buy these. And then let's just look for like a nice detective.
expensive hat. This hat looks pretty drippy. Let's go ahead and buy it. Wait, bro, why is the hat so small? I just wasted 70 Robux on that hat. Bro, okay, it's fine. Don't detectives also have mustaches? Yeah, this mustache right here looks pretty good. And then, uh, th this, this looks like a pretty good face. You know what I'm saying? Guys, rate the drip 1 through 10 of this face right here. Now, we just need some hair. And you know what? If I'm a detective, I should also get some sunglasses. Let me go ahead and buy these. And now, let's put all of these items together and see how our avatar looks. And guys, this avatar is looking so drippy. Bro, honestly, we are like the best detective ever. Now, really quick, before we join Mr. Sweaty Bob, aka Josh, I want to spend the 139 Robux I have right here giving out a few more game passes. I should be able to give out like special cosmetics or extra emote slots if like two people want that. So, let me go ahead and check my comment section real quick. And okay, here's the one from my recent video who wants extra emote slots. I got you. Bro, I'm reading the chat right now. What even is this? This server is full of nine-year-olds. Actually, I'm 10. I'm losing brain cells reading this server. Uh, guys, please, please don't be like the people in this game. But yeah, let me go ahead and give extra emote slots to this guy. And if you guys also want to get gifted a game pass, watch the full video because I'm gonna say somewhere in the video how you guys can win. But yeah, let's go ahead and join Sweaty Bob now. I pulled up uh, Sweaty Bob's profile and it looks like he's in a game right now. So let me go ahead and join him. Now, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and become sweaty bob's friend and then we're gonna scab him um it looks like sweaty bob is being very toxic in the chat he said bro you all suck hashtag 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 i'm just gonna type in the chat josh 101v1 and then i guess we're gonna 1v1 him real quick i kind of want to see how good he is at this game he just said okay bet all right i'm gonna switch to deadly ninja and then we're gonna try to find him where is mr josh at oh is that him right there i think that is him okay 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 is he gonna wait wait, wait. i'm gonna pick up a trash can and then hit him with it he's just said who asked does anyone else get so annoyed when people say who asked like i swear bro it is actually the stupidest thing please just do scatter on him oh is this other guy gonna try and kill him <laughs> yes sir we're gonna 2v1 josh and he's gonna die this is what you get josh for scamming people yoink bro how did that trash can hit me and not him i swear uh at least he's down to have health though i'm just gonna do scatter no josh not today you are not gonna be winning any fights today this guy just said focus on your target you stupid yeah why is he hitting this guy and not me like josh we are literally 1v1ing and you're just fighting some random other guy josh i think you were stupid we do whirlwind kick yoink and bro you are literally two more shots i can probably just finish him off with explosive shuriken you're dead bozo and then i don't even have any emotes on this account let me just redeem my one emote so i can use it on him yeah el bozo why does this emote like perfectly match with my avatar it's actually kind of funny dude it matches perfectly because like detectives have suit cases all right let me find this josh guy and we are going to uh we're gonna add him to my private server oh wait, he's walking back up to me he said bro you suck I was getting 2 v one rematch. That was not fair at all. Don't make me bring in my hacker group. Guys, should we get Josh to bring in his hacker group later in the video? Dude, that would be so funny. But yeah, I mean, if you want to rematch, let's go, Josh. I'll rematch you, bozo. I Yeah, I'll do it. You're already getting super low. I, I think he's like typing something in the chat. Okay, I'll let him type because I don't want to be too unfair. Bro, you're so trash and ugly. Yeah, I, I'm trash and ugly. Okay, who's the one that sounds a half health? He just asked, why did you name your yourself mango pool um because i'm a fan of him he just said mango pool is the worst youtuber ever bro there is no way he's saying that i am the worst youtuber like bro there is no way who are you a fan of then this guy's probably like a fan of lanky box or something i hope he never hits 200k guys everyone like and subscribe so we can hit 200k and we got ultimate okay i'm gonna activate this and uh josh is probably going to be raging a lot let me just do twin blade rush on this bozo dude twin blade rush is such a good move i love this move so much and uh josh you're dead wait let me just do this on you uh to make sure yeah yeah yep he's dead oh and he respawned yo i'm gonna just spawn kill him uh with the rest of my ultimate really quick let me just do twin blade rush once again bro he is probably raging so hard like imagine just the second you spawn in you just get hit with ultimate that happens to me once like you guys know when you'll spawn in and they'll just immediately be using incinerate oh he's raging in the chat he just said stop spawn killing bro i will spawn kill you all that i want i don't care you 
you're dead. Bro, you're so trash. Nah, wanna know who's trash? You. Let me just go ahead and use my emote once again. Let me just get this guy in my private server. And we are going to scam him back. Now, right now, I need to just, like, try and befriend this guy. Because right now, he is probably gonna, like, not fall for the scam if I'm acting like a hater of his. But he's raging in the chat. He just said, shut up. Your dad left you and you're gonna grow up to be Adam Sandler. Bro, what? I would want to be Adam Sandler when I grow up. Like, what is bad about being Adam Sandler when you grow up? But he just said, bro, rematch. The past three 1v1s were just warm-ups. I just said, okay, let's rematch in my private server. And he said, okay, bet. Let's go right now. I'll join. Okay, I'm gonna add this guy to my private server really quick. And once we get in the private server, I'm just gonna start acting like a mangle fool hater. I need to go ahead and make a private server though, because this is like a brand new account, so I don't have one yet. I'm just gonna call this server name Mango Pool Sucks. And then let me go ahead and add him. His username is SweatyBob2324. That username is so dumb. Bro, his privacy settings! Okay, I'm gonna have to message him on Roblox and tell him to change his privacy settings. Okay, there. Now we invited him. And also, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change my display name really quick to Mango Pool Big Hater. <laughs> Bro, that username is so stupid. But yeah, let's go ahead and just load into the private server now. Also, guys, keep watching the video if you want a chance to win some game passes because I'm only giving out game passes to people who comment the secret word. A lot of people, like, don't comment the secret word. But yeah, we just loaded it into the private server. While we're waiting for him to load in, honestly, I'm just gonna farm ultimate on the weakest subby. Honestly, it's kind of OP that you can get ultimate points from just hitting the weakest subby. You have to kill him quite a few times, but I mean, it's still ultimate points. I'll take it. We are straight farming them right now. L weakest W. Just kidding, guys. Don't be toxic to the weakest dummy. The weakest dummy is a human too. And okay, here he is right here. He just loaded in. Oh, he just said, wait, are you a mango pool hater? Yes, mango pool is the worst YouTuber. I know he sucks. He's never gonna hit 200k. Yeah, I hope he stays at 150k forever. Thanks for opening my eyes and making me realize how much of a horrible YouTuber he is. Glad to help, bro. That is crazy. No, this guy is actually such a big hater for no reason. Do you know anything about hacking, by the way? Wait, is he gonna invite us to his hacking group? Okay, I'm gonna say, yeah, I love hacking people. I do it every single day. Well, I actually have a hacker group consisting of only mango pool haters. Bro, the hacking group that she was talking about earlier was also a mango pool hater group. Nah, that is crazy. Okay, that is actually insane. Wait, should I try and get into this group and then just scam all of them? Dude, that's actually such a good idea. I'm gonna ask in the chat, can I I join this group? Yeah, you can join, but I need you to do a 10 question quiz to prove you're a real hater of Mango Pool. Okay, like I am literally Mango Pool, so I should be able to answer this question perfectly. Question one, is Mango Pool actually the top G? Okay, we all know the real answer to this is yes, Mango Pool is the top G, but since this guy is a Mango Pool hater, I'm gonna have to say no, he is not the top G. Perfect, you got the first question right. Mango Pool will never be the top G. He he sucks. Yeah, Mango Pool sucks, guys. Mango Pool is the worst YouTuber. Okay, what is the second question gonna be? Question two. Who is Mango's brother that is way better than him, by the way? Bro, is he talking about Daiwei? Yep, Daiwei, the guy who got his Roblox girlfriend pregnant, he's uh, he's definitely way better than I am. Nobody said any hate to Daiwei, though. He already gets a lot of hate, so guys, don't don't send any hate to Daiwei. Don't be toxic. But I'm just gonna type in the chat. Daiwei is so much better than Mango Pool. He's the top G. Daiwei is such a good YouTuber. I love all of his videos. Yeah, guys, this video right here, top 10 hottest kids in Roblox Bedwars is honestly, that's like my favorite video that was ever uploaded to YouTube. I also liked the video where he 1v1 tanker, uh, who is definitely his brother. Yeah, yeah, Daiwei, this definitely wasn't your friend on an alt account, but I I'm just trying to get this quiz over with and get into the hacker group. What is the third question? Question three, what is Mango Pool's other channel called? Okay, well, I had a channel before my Mango Pool channel that was called mango pool i think he's probably talking about this channel which guys everyone we are going to pass this channel in subscribers I i'm gonna start uploading on here again eventually once a new game comes out but for now i i haven't uploaded for seven months on here his other channel is called mango pool and i'm a really big hater of that channel too yeah i've been hating on him ever since the funky friday videos two years ago bro two years this guy's been my biggest hater for two years that is crazy i literally posted these funky friday videos over two years ago okay Okay, that is wild. The only good Funky Friday YouTuber was Kellogg's. Okay, I wonder what happened to- That is crazy. I am- We are not gonna be talking about
about Kellogish in this video. Yeah, mm hmm he he was such a good YouTuber. I I wonder why he got banned off of YouTube. Yeah, we're we're not gonna talk about that guy. Question four: When did Mango start playing the strongest battlegrounds? Oh, uh, I think I started playing like in May. Actually, it might have been a bit earlier. L let me check when Sud uploaded his video trolling me. This video right here with 1.1 million views on Sud's channel. This was like my first time ever playing the strongest battlegrounds. Oh, and it was posted in April of 2023. Okay. Bro, I still had my old Doge avatar in that video. I'm just gonna say the first time he played was April 2023. Yeah, and it was in Sud's garbage video. I also hate Sud. Bro, there is no way. This guy literally knows everything about me. He probably knows every single disease I've ever had. Question five. What is Mango Pool's ex-girlfriend name? Bro, I've literally never like revealed anything about her, like her name, a picture of her or anything online. If this guy knows what she's named, that is gonna be crazy. Wait, I wanna see if he actually knows. I'm gonna ask. Can you give me a hint? Her hair is blonde and the first four letters of her name is M-A-D-I. Bro, her name is literally Madison. What? And her hair is blonde. Bro, how does he know this? No, this guy's actually like a next level stalker. Does this guy like know me in real life or something? Bro, what? Her name is Madison. Bro, if he somehow. I'm actually like shocked right now, guys. Correct. I'm gonna slide into her DM soon. Okay, that is some next level hating. There is no way. Bro, honestly, you can have her. I don't even care about her. I haven't cared about her for like a year and a half please come back that is no no i don't care yeah you can have her question six is mango pool adopted bro i am not adopted what is this guy saying no incorrect he is adopted okay i don't know where this guy got this false information from because i am definitely not adopted question seven who is mango's celebrity crush that will never notice him okay so if you guys watch my channel then you definitely know that it is olivia rodrigo but bro she is going to notice me someday all right guys she will definitely notice me someday olivia rodrigo but I, th I think she might notice him eventually. She'll never notice him, but correct. Okay, bro, can we just get this quiz over with? Question eight, should Mango Pool quit YouTube? Yes, he should quit. Okay, final question. What day did Mango Pool make his YouTube channel? Okay, I made this channel earlier this year, the day before my birthday, because I wanted to see how big I could get it, like, by next year. And so far, after seven months, we're at 150k subscribers. But yeah, I created this channel on February 13th, which is the day before my birthday. And then I posted my first video on February 14th, which like is my birthday. Just so you guys know, I'm not lying. This is like my birthday right here. Also, you guys should boost me on this website. I'm only the 11,800 most popular person. But yeah, I just said he made his channel on February 13th. And Josh just said, correct. You are the only person who's gotten every question right on this quiz. We would love to have you join our scammer crew. Okay, watch this. Here's what I'm gonna say. I'll join, but can you give me metal bat? And he said, okay, sure. I'll gift it to you. Check your characters. Okay, let's see. Bro, Metal Bat is literally right there. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna join on my main account and tell them that it was actually me, Mango Pool, the entire time. I just left the game. Uh, let me get the private server link. Before I load in, by the way, if you guys want to win a game pass, just call me L Josh. But yeah, I'm loading into the private server on my main account. And now I'm gonna walk up to him and I'm gonna say, Lol, it was me, Mango, the whole time. L Bozo. He said, Bro, you suck i'm leaving i hope you never hit 200k you're trash and he left the game bro no way